Okay. 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 <laughs> this could have started better. This could have started better. Whew. Uh, will you work, please? Yeah, okay, cool. All right. <laughs> Working? Yeah, okay, cool. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to the Great Book of Grudges. My name is Nathan. I am really sorry. I'm late. There's a mistake in the, um, on the thumbnail. Uh, <laughs> I've just come back from the gym. I've just uh, finished training at home, too, afterwards. So, like, I'm running on... Low energy, I had to stuff food down my throat. It was, yeah, insane. But hello everyone, how are you guys all doing? I'm seeing a lot of names over here. Flan, Tobias, uh, Swatso, The Duke, um, Emra, uh, Rowan, Holber Monkey, Lewis, Baron, TPH, Giovanni. How are you guys all doing? So yeah, uh, fun stream. We're, we've just hit 25,000 subscribers. That's super cool, isn't it? And I figured we'd play as not Christopher Columbus and invade North America. When Warhammer free? Uh, don't know. Don't know. So this should be fun. I do apologize for the uh, spelling mistake, the, late, the, the, the lateness and everything. Uh, it, it's just, yeah. I decided to try and get back into shape and boom. I did not plan everything correctly. Hey, hello, ha, ha, how are you doing? Hey, Ernie, hey, uh, um, hey, Linksy, how you guys all doing? Sorry if I've missed anyone out. But, Blair basically means like, damn, you know? Daughter Princess is better anyway. Yeah, it's Daughter Princess. But yeah, I've just been running around. Uh, just uh, here to say hello. I've been awake for 35 hours at this point. We'll have to get some sleep soon. Yeah, get some sleep, mate. Get some sleep. Sleep is important. I hope you guys can hear me well. I had to get the setup done very, very quickly. So I've been running around like a absolute lunatic. But we are here. Uh, best of Talia roster, best of uh, Stallion roster, and no scaling around. Yeah, but we do have to deal with Mavs de Mundi at some point. Now, I wanted to play as Big Boy over here because uh, Marco Colombo is a rather interesting character. I really, really love him. I've actually got all his iterations in mini form and even the special Games Days ones and so on. So, just wanted to have a little bit of fun. This is going to be really, really cool. But, uh, yeah, we're going to just try and do so much damage. We're going to be able to increase our relations with the Lizardmen, too, it seems. That's actually rather cool. Hey, Thomas, how are you doing? That's Southern Realms mod. Yes, it's Southern Realms. But we're going to try and do as much damage as possible. We do know that we have to take the Maku Peaks and the Shrine of Sotek, which if I... Why is Maku Peaks belonging to... Lizardmen? Yeah. Shouldn't that be a Skaven faction? Sound is perfect. Fantastic. Well, that sounds like I'm saying Blech in Russian. What's that mean, then? The He's a cr cross between Marco Polo and Christopher Columbus. Yeah. Hey, Rafa, how you doing? Reminded to you, Nathan, I'm still on a crusade against the FLC bug. I'm going to bother every streamer to do a video about it. Hey, uh, yeah, I, I've checked it out. I've just not had time right now. I've been incredibly busy due to real life work, but I should be able to do something. I'm not sure if my cat's going to puke on the microphone or he's just making that face. What are you doing? Let me bring you here just in case. Yep. Come on. <laughs> so, yeah. Say hello to the cat, everyone. Yep. Oh, and it's raining really hard. So if you start hearing a uh, static -y noise, it's literal rain that's happening outside. Now, we're going to start trying to do some damage. So I guess we should focus on growth at the beginning because we're on only small minor settlements. And then we're going to try to go here. Mixes uh, legendary moves, moves in there. Okay, okay, that makes sense. Should bro up with Wolfheart if you can. That would be cool. Apparently, Marco and Wolfheart don't like each other, though. Remember that you're close to the Amazons there. They should be neutral to you, but having them as allies would be a good idea. 
Oh, that's good to know. That's good to know. Hey, people, how are you doing? Since Estalia went so well, we're going to play more Estalia in Lustria. What could possibly go wrong? Cool, cool. You see, I was fighting the Skaven, and now we're going to be fighting against the freaking uh, lizards instead. There is no real life yet. Yeah, unfortunately, there is. There is. Uh, we're getting a bunch of stuff sorted, and I was not prepared for the absolute shit show of work today, then going to the gym and so on. I am in a lot of pain. It, today was abs and arms, and I kind of felt it. Yeah, we got the cat over here. You could probably see his head lit bopping up every now and then, but obviously, since he's camouflaged to my shirt, you won't be able to see him until his eyes pop out. You can hear it. It's quite nice. Yeah, it's, it's a little bit of a theme. Obviously, we're in the rainforest, so raining works quite well here, doesn't it? But yeah, I'm assuming there's going to be a Skaven faction here. This is a minor settlement. What I'm going to do is possibly... Ooh, yeah, okay, we can get some crossbows now. That's actually going to be in our benefit. We won't need the full faction, but we can go from there. That literally means prostitute. Ooh. Hey, J. Durfu, how are you doing? Marco Colombo, I might have to close the window if it's a bit too much, so we'll just do this. Hopefully that's not too bad. Uh, Marco Colombo does friendly relations with the lizards. El Cadavo is the bro of Marcus and, bo bo and both hates lizards. Oh, okay, okay. Well, hopefully we can just be friendly with Mazda Mummy for a while until we are actually ready for something. Charge, Santiago. Hey, Esteban, how are you doing? Oh, hola. Como estas? Good job making it to the gym. Yeah, I've let myself go during COVID, so I'm making sure that I get back into shape. I tried to put on my blazer for, for New Year's, like if there's going to be a New Year's celebration, but you know, one can hope. And um, yeah, I was not in a good place. Oh, okay. Why not? Yeah, Blood Bowl is amazing, Beep Boop. I'm actually a very, very big fan. We're gonna have to fight this dude. He's got our, he's got our capital. Though we do have to deal with a certain opera singer too. It's gonna be right, quite interesting. Yeah, but thanks for helping. Start collecting minis is more harder than I imagined. Yeah, it can be a little daunting, but don't worry. If you've got questions and stuff, you can always ask me. Exercise is never punishment, but celebration of life. Don't want your doctor tell you that you're getting a trophy. Ah, yeah, true, true. Uh, where are we going over here? Sorry, if I, if I miss your question or your uh, message, just repeat it just in case. Bo, bo, no aggression fact. And um, trade agreement? No, okay. Non aggression pact will work. Now, do you like me for the fact of that? No, you just like me because of affinity. All right, why not? Hey, Mr. Fjordbjorn, how are you doing? Well, in France, New Year would be a drag. Oh, is it bad? See, I, I've been trying to hope for a New Year's celebration or something, but like, uh, I, I need to get back into shape if I want to fit into my suit, man, because <laughs> it was actually really depressing. I've lost muscle mass. I've, uh, I, I, I've just, I've not taken very good care of myself, which is understandable. You know, a lot of us haven't during this period. So yeah, I'm gonna try for that. If not, we're here to celebrate with you. Yeah, of course, uh, Lord Chaos. I mean, there's gonna be a celebration anyway. I've got a special video planned out for the new year too. So you know, let's hope everything goes well. Hey, War Master. So Lustra is the best character ever. Actually, she was done quite well. So I actually can agree with you that she's a very good character. Uh, she was implemented very, very well for a original work by um, by our friends at CA. I thought they did something really, really good there, to be honest. I would have gone for a different character, but you know, she was done well. Can you stop just thrashing your tail about? Uh, he wants a non-aggression pact. You know what? We're going to do that. Why not? 
And we're going to start fighting her. I feel aggressive today. I feel proper aggressive today. The rain's hitting hard. It feels great. It actually feels like December. It's great. And I'm able to celebrate it with you guys because we've hit 25k. Which is cool. Yeah? No, the cat's not impressed. He's powering, but he's not impressed. I actually got in the shape, uh, couldn't fit into my suit because I put so, so much muscle that I buffed up like 10 kilos. Boom. Uh, let's just go over here. Uh, I need public order. We need to recruit. We're going to be fighting undead, so I'm assuming some more range will do us good and we'll just go from there. Uh, ooh, wow, we got a fast-moving chat today. Yeah, yeah, the cat even says it too. Um, I've not been fit in three months. Uh, you have not fit in yours in three months. Oh, don't worry, dude. I, I've not been able to fit in my leg for a while now because, yeah, you know, these things happen. The, the, you get lazy during this type of year, especially with then with the lockdowns where you have to... Uh, <laughs> you know, it's like, oh yeah, you have stuck at home, and then there's all these apps to order food, so you're like, damn, yeah? Uh, Dick Barnacle Beard, god, I love Vampire Coast names, yeah, they're, they're done really well. Also smart to pick up gyms uh, before the January period, uh, I've got equipment at home, I've been buying loads and loads of equipment here. So yeah, why, why not? Oh, Godrick and Felix are here. You're always aggressive. Uh, I'm not too bad, killer. Oh, so holy fuck, 25k, that's amazing. Yeah, exactly, man, I'm feeling good. I'm feeling good, because this was all because of you guys, yeah? So, like, I owe you guys a lot. I'm actually really, really grateful. I'm going to open up a Red Bull. I don't think I should, considering I've been running up and down today. But I'm feeling super damn good about the situation. Uh, we're gonna get rid of the stat now pikemen we should keep get rid of swordsmen and maybe two spearmen we can keep the rest and get the rest of them as crossbows and then we should be good but I'm really really thankful about it I mean fucking hell man we've gone from what 2,000 subs in the space of a year to I mean close to freaking yeah well actually we're there we're a quarter of a way to a freaking play button that's amazing you know it, and it's all thanks to you guys which is absolutely fucking insane. So, I'm obviously in an amazed mood. I wasn't expecting this happening beyond my wildest dreams, if I can be completely honest. So, damn, man. Like, thank you. Right, let's, let's just go down here and let's do some damage. Uh, yeah, let's fight her. Oh, did I put no? Yeah. It's raining really, really hard. Ew, okay. I was expecting we'd be able to attack, but that's fine. We'll be like that. No, she'll attack us anyway. Uh, where are we here? Yeah, we're getting a uh, Minecraft server because uh, I, I promised you guys. I did promise you guys that we were gonna... That's a very strange army composition, but hey, at least I know I can win this one. History College, that sounds really, really cool. Guys, if I do miss what you're saying, just say it again, if, if anything, because uh, the chat's going super fast. I'm running on that. I'm camouflaged with my own freaking shirt. I should have probably picked a different color. But yeah. Hey, a Concealed Coffee, how are you doing? Guys, Concealed Coffee is a Twitch streamer who is up and coming. Really, really talented. Uh, ooh, what's happening here? We got a donation of two euros from Linksy. You deserve all of it. Just so, just keep going, my man. Thank you, my dude. Linksy is a very talented dude. Uh, he likes to dress up like a grandma on streams, which is super weird. But we're gonna be working together really, really soon. So I'm looking forward to that. Something very, very soon. And hey, look, it came up around the same time as that. That's awesome. <laughs>
you're one of the most consistent and fastest Warhammer news guy out there. Hey, I love Warhammer. So uh, being able to um, do this, should have picked a green shirt. <laughs> yeah, that would have been awkward, wouldn't it? Um, I, I, do, um, I do love doing this. I do love doing this. I, I'm very, I can be very honest with the fact that uh, being able to do this as a sorted job, I guess, is like a dream come true. So I'm I'm actually um, uh, I'm actually really really amazed. So guys, like seriously, thank you so much. And Teddy YS donated. Uh, I don't know what Ron is, so if you guys can tell me what that is, that would be really cool. Congrats, man! You deserve it. Found you through Legend of Total War. And I don't regret it. Did you say something about Minecraft? Yeah, I did promise that we would have a uh, Discord Minecraft server, so people could play and so on, and we could just fuck about and all that. And that's going to happen very soon. We have uh, two awesome things. We have really two awesome things that's going to happen. <coughs> On the 19th, we've got something being released with uh, a special guest stream, which is going to be really cool. I honestly can't wait. And uh, then I'm going to get the Minecraft server, which I'm already planning ahead anyway. I've already been speaking links. He's been helping me out, deciding what the fuck to do and so on. So I'm absolutely amazed. Um, it's, it's going to be really, really cool, guys. It's going to be really, really cool. Now, let's try not to die, yeah? And <laughs> let's go in. So, we got the dogs of war here. Which, eh, we're in a decent place. So, yeah. By the way, I never figure out uh, where do you come from. Uh, what are your origins? I am from Gibraltar, which is a British colony in the south of Spain. So, I am a... a pretty bit of a mixed half-breed which is kind of cool i get the best of british i get the best of spanish in my blood uh that means i can enjoy a nice siesta but also uh enjoy um well a nice fight in a bar i guess <laughs> romanian lure oh that's awesome that is absolutely awesome minecraft steve tattoo at, uh, at 50k no god no god no uh, oh, we are being slaughtered here. Any mod on the server? There might be a mod. I've been looking at one which is kind of Warhammer themed. Now, of course, I have to make sure that everything works and so on. But we'll, we'll see what we can do. We'll see what we can do. Now, i got to move these boys up. And... Because I am getting shot at. Left, right and freaking center. <coughs> hey, what the hell are you doing? Ooh, shit. Right, explodey boy, and they broke. Okay. I was not paying too much attention. <laughs> uh, these things happen. Okay, let's just move down this way. Uh, let's bring you in to do some melee damage. Hey, Belly, how you guys, how you doing, my dude? Monster series with coffee. Ooh. That sounds kind of interesting. Tell me more. Tell me more. Hey, uh, Psychology Bear, sweet. Well, sweet, I guess. How you guys, how you doing? Also, you play ARK for two days and you and I reach 25k? Yeah, I've been on a roll lately. I've been on a roll. It's been it's been super cool. I got worried that after the DLC we might suffer a bit of a content drought. But hey. Crossbows went so well last time. How could they not be the tack again? Actually, they're doing fine. It's actually it was my positioning. You're mean today, the Duke, aren't you? <laughs> I'm fine, I'm fine. Everything seems to be going well enough. It's more about positioning more than anything, and I just need to get out there and do the damage I need to do. Now, the great thing is we are dealing with just undead, which will pretty much melt. So we'll go from there. Not enough crossbows. Yeah, we're going to start switching up to guns when I can get them. You do not have the dogs of war. They have the dogs of war. Yeah, they kind of deleted both my... Um, well, the main... They kind of deleted the main source of cavalry that I had, which is kind of frustrating. But we seem to be okay. We seem to be okay. 
So Blood Bowl stream when? Actually very soon. I've been planning a bunch of new content for the start of the year. We're going to have a lot of cool stuff. We're going to have some 40k games, uh, 40k lore, Age of Sigma lore, Warhammer Fantasy lore. Uh, I'm in a... I'm in a I'm in a good mood to um, to explore with different things. Obviously, we'll still have daily Total War Warhammer content because, well, it's something. It's it's the game I absolutely love. So uh, it's going to be a lot of days where you guys are going to get like two videos a day and so on. Uh, pending, yeah, because like maybe one day I can't do two videos and so on. Do you read Warhammer books at all? Yeah, I do. I read a lot of Warhammer books. Uh, I've actually just been reading the, um, the Wolfric book once again, because after everyone kept asking me and I kept hyping it up again, I was like, damn, I need to read the book again. It was so good. So I've got that next to my bedside table. I've just been chilling with that. Hey, Attila, how are you doing? Uh, let me just go for here. Yeah, they're starting to break. Yeah, okay, we got this, we got this. I, I did lose my cavalry, which probably wasn't the best thing to do, but then again, you know, I was distracted. I was chilling with you guys, you know? Blood Bowl free early access confirmed. I've not requested it, but I'm going to request it. It's a bit of a finicky thing because uh, the publisher and I don't have the best relation, I want to say. Uh... I really hope that we will not wait DLC for six months, uh, for Warhammer for like six months, it would kill me. Yeah, I, I hope so too, man. I hope so too. What are uh, carabiners? Uh, ca carabiners? Uh, like r rifle infantry? I think they were cav, weren't they? Uh, where are we here? What do you think about the Twisted and Twilight DLC and who's your favorite uh, lord between the fro uh, sister and the frots? The, uh, sorry, frot and the sisters. I'm going to have to say, uh, I'm going to have to say Frot was my favorite, but then again, I am biased for the Skaven. And if, in regards to the DLC, I think more could have honestly be done for the high uh, for the Wood Elves. Uh, I think a lot more could have been done for the Wood Elves, possibly. Oh, look, we, did we keep the horse? Oh, yeah, we kept the horses. Great. It's a shame that they weren't, they didn't get as much, but I feel like they got a decent amount. Let's just put it that way, yeah? Not enough to call it perfect, but given the circumstances of a lockdown where all of them were all away and working from home and so on, um, you know, we have to be sympathetic towards CA in regards to that. They've done as much as they could. Yeah, the Orion Trilogy is absolutely great. Yeah, we're going to get a lot more videos, don't you worry. Yeah, I'm, I, I'm a big fan of Marco Colombo. I love, I love the minis. I absolutely love the minis. Right, we're going to try and fight her. I don't want to fight with the orcs just yet, but it looks like... Ooh, he does not like me. Ooh, that's, that's a bit scary. Uh, Nathan, how did the previous campaign go with the Skaven were being rather formidable? Uh, we had to stop it at a certain point. I was getting super tired. I was making loads of stupid mistakes, and it's like, woof. But we are okay, though. We are we are doing quite well over here, which is the most important thing, and we're having fun, and that's the most important thing here. Uh, I did see some messages. I'm trying to be as quick to respond to everyone, but I'm not used to so many messages at a time, so I'm like, you know? Uh, I'm so happy for you reaching uh, 25k. I haven't been happy in a while. I mean, I told you I was going to get it soon. I knew I was going to get it. Nah, I was kidding. I've actually got the worst um, the worst self-esteem ever. So I actually thought, it's like, ooh, we might not get this. But this was really, really fun. I couldn't believe that we actually, we, we got to freaking 25k. I'm, I'm absolutely like amazed. Raffin is awakening soon, very soon. Uh, preparing for a vacation. Oh, awesome, Attila. Where are you going? The factions get so much better with the SFO submod. Uh, yeah, but since SFO is down, and to be honest, uh, like it usually has an issue with every single mod I have. Because not everything has a um, 
Not everything has a sub mod, which is a shame because I've got a lot of favorite mods. We are actually trying to see if we can get a sub mod sorted for Rathen too. So people can play SFO with Rathen. The guys who make the mobile Warhammer game, they showed on uh, interesting character. Oh, they showed off Brunner. Yeah, he's a Southern Realms character. Well, he's a he's a mercenary more than anything. What did I miss? Interesting. So, oh, okay, so... <laughs> she went and attacked the orcs. The orcs then got destroyed, and then... Wolfheart attacked... Oh, okay, yeah, that makes sense. Why not? Uh, hey, greetings from Italy. Hey, Aluvi, how are you doing? I hope I'm pronouncing your name correctly. I found an eBay, search on Google, and uh, found this monster. Has made a series with coffee. It's called Java. I need to try that. I need to freaking try that. I love those types of things. That'd be cool. Thank you, the Duke. That would be quite helpful. We're going to launch on the 19th, so it's going to be quite cool. Well, the plan is to launch on the 19th. The absolutely amazing models that I've been working to create... Uh, to create Raffin, man, like every day they surprise me with more and more things. And I'm like, I just want the Lord. You guys are giving me faction effects, new units and stuff like that. And they're like, yeah, you know, we can be as creative as we want because it's not law friendly. It's like, yeah, but you, I, I just literally want the Lord. You guys have gone way, way higher than expected. Like, it's so cool. Uh, where are we going here? Make the self-esteem after reaching 25k. Well, now we wait for me to get cancelled, I guess. Yep. <laughs> I, I want to see if I can get to 100. I think I could, man. I, like, uh, I know Major Kill has been like really helping me. Like, oh yeah, you're doing great. You're doing great. I really hope I can do it. It would be really cool, you know. Uh, the Great Book of Grudges. Uh, in the Warhammer fantasy, in Warhammer fantasy, who would you kill? Who would you take to bed? And who would you marry? Just marry, fuck, kill for Warhammer. Um, okay. Um, who would I kill? Manfred. Uh, who would I fuck? <laughs> um, Alariel seems like a good choice. And... Who would I marry? I'd say Isabella. She seems like a very supportive wife. Bavarian peasant, uh, peanut. Sorry. Uh, he, uh, hey, how's it going? Congrats on hitting twenty-five k. Thank you, mate. Thank you, mate. Like seriously, it's been a hell of a journey. Yeah, I almost did auto resolve that. Hey, Rod, how you doing? Was that like a framing issue? What happened there? Yeah, it's oh, a bit weird, isn't it? Hey, talk. How you doing? Uh. Where, where, where are we? I'm trying to make sure that I've not missed anything on chat. But I'm like trying to make sure that I don't get killed too, you know? Anything you've cooked up that could uh, that would have been a good addition to the wood else? I do have a video on that coming out very soon. But I'm working on this Beastman playlist. Because I released the Go for one and I got a lot of flack. It's like, well, you know, he's too similar to Kazrak. But it's like, but this one came first. Kazrak was second. She's the only good choice except Katarina. I mean, I stick though. Brings a whole new meaning to blue balls, you know? I need to shoot that guy before I make a mistake again. Warmaster Moloch, kill Manfred, fuck Neferata, marry Isabella. You see, we more or less have the same um, idea, do we? <laughs> as long as everyone's cool with killing Manfred, like you can pick anything else, you know? <laughs> yes, 
Uh, right, let's just move around, cycle through there. All these crossbows please the Elector Count of Solund. Yeah, I, I've started off quite weak, but then again, you know, it's versus Celestra, and she's pretty much going to die now, so I think we're okay. Dad for the dad god. Oh my god, there's a Manfred in here. <laughs> uh, where were we here? I would marry Tic Tac Toe, fuck Snickerch, and kill Archeo. No Archeo, no end times. Uh, there'd still be an, uh, an end times, to be honest. It's kind of like embedded into the history that uh, it's not just him. Did Kaz uh, didn't Kazrak die at the same time as Todd uh, when he stabbed him? Uh, no, no. Kazrak was got killed by Toddy, and then all the rest of the beastmen ripped him to part, uh, ripped him to shreds. Go for his own brand. Kazrak is great value. Uh, I guess. I guess. Hey, Perturabo, how you doing? We've got a Primark in chat. Uh, where are we going here? Uh, is it possible for another DLC for the uh, Wood Elves in the future? I'd say so. There's enough. There's enough. There's definitely enough units and missing characters to warrant a DLC. At least, I, I really hope so, because I, I kind of wanted Araloth. I know a lot of people are like, oh yeah, but he's a generic elf. It's like, yeah, but his mini was cool. And Fred did nothing wrong. Beep poop, why? Definitely fuck Morafi. Yeah, I could see that. Uh, where are we here? If you're interested, there's even one monster with milk. Dude, God no, God no. I had some alcohol, this, some, this weird alcoholic drink with fucking milk inside it. It was probably the foulest thing I've ever tasted, if I can be very, very honest. Oh, she's still alive. I thought I was... Okay. Um... I don't want to get this. Do we have anything against vampires, greenskins, dark elves, skaven? No, we'll just start focusing on this shit then. Nothing to reduce upkeep? No. Hmm. I mean, we can get lightning strike super early, so why not? Maybe when you play Blood Bowl, you could do a tournament with people on your Discord. Now, that would be kind of cool. I want to do more community events. And I think it would be cool to see some community events take part with um, at the start of the year. Because I'm going to have, hopefully, 16 days off. And if I do, that means that 16 days off to work on a variety of content. And it's going to be super cool. Let's, let's hope for the best, though. Is she gone, then? I, I don't see her. I don't see her. I don't trust her. We're going to have to see a bit here. Nathan's absolutely doing re relatively well. Yeah, I mean, I think it's because uh, I'm just in a good mood. I'm feeling confident. You know, the whole getting to 25k keeps the mind competent. Uh, you know, I wasn't expecting that. Plus, going to the gym again kind of really boosted up my... My mood, I, I actually feeling, I'm feeling really good. I'm feeling really, really good. Maybe I should just start hitting the gym more often. I mean, I've got it. Oh, there she is. Okay, cool. Uh, I, I've been wanting to uh, get back to it. My, I used to do daily routines and so on. I was relatively fit until, you know. So I feel good. I feel good. I'm with you guys. I'm able to chat. You know, it's all awesome. Okay, so she's over here. I don't think we're going to be able to get there in time. Marcus doesn't like me. He likes me enough. We have an on-aggression pact. He won't break it. If we go this way, that would take three turns. If we go up this way, it would take two. Yeah, let's do that. Let's see if we can.
Uh, where are we here? Sorry if I'm missing anything. I'd like to see flying ze uh, zeppelins for dwarves with lots of cannons on it. Let's make dwarves great again. Yeah, the Thunder Barge would be really fun. If you didn't know, that is an actual official unit. And uh, it, it was pretty deadly. It was pretty deadly. It was pr like, it could do a lot of damage on the tabletop. What does the Emperor bid? This will right, let's try. No Go for her. I'm not too bothered about the rebellion. I'm more bothered about her. Which I don't think we can reach. Raise your weapons. Yeah, okay. Dwarves. I mean... Upkeep for all units, but that's actually for the, for the first army. So what we're going to do is this. And then just encamp ourselves over here. What about a fighting game for uh, Warhammer? That'd be kind of fun, wouldn't it? Eat from and grow in one go. I mean, why not? Why not? Blood Bowl law better than the Age of Sigma law? Yeah, but we, we, we have to cover a little bit of Age of Sigma. Because, yes. you know what, I'm not as salty about Age of Sigmar existing anymore, because we're getting Old World, and that was the most important thing to me. So as long as we know we're getting our, our world the back, the rest of the stuff just actually feels like it can be, it can survive, you know? This COVID is all my brother Mortarian's fault. I mean, if we could be very honest, is it not more Typhus doing anything instead of Mortarian? Because every book I've read, Mortarian seems like a bit of a bitch. Hey, Triple Herbals, how you doing, my dude? Warhorse and Doom Cross. Ooh. Huh? This sounds interesting. What's a Doom Crossbow? Cause he's already got uh he's already got something, doesn't he? I mean, we're gonna get a few things, we might as well give it a try. It sounds interesting at the very least. We're gonna have to fight Marcus in a sec though. Now we're in a good term with Mazda Mundi. So what I'm trying to do is get Okay, never mind. We'll go from there. Uh, I feel bad for all the peasants having to make all the crossbow bolts for uh, for that army. Hey, I, I went for a... I just offered you the same thing, you piece of crap. Stupid Master Mundi. Right, let's just open the window again because it's hot as shit at the moment. A little bit of rain won't hurt you guys. But, uh... Where were we? I mean, the army is not too bad. We're going to start upgrading them in a sec. Now the fact is that we are decent with these guys. We can start fucking about and going to these little islands and so on. And get some extra cash. So right now, I'm feeling good. We're going to go up here to Swamp Town. And then move around. I think we're okay. I think we're doing alright, to be honest. Hey, Naldo, how are you doing? Uh, just because you aren't salty about Age of uh, uh, you aren't salty doesn't mean that you can't dump on Age of Sigma. Ooh, no, 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 not Military Alliance. You, you like to fight with too many people. But, um... I guess... No, no, I'll still dump on it a little bit, because, you know, it's still kind of fun. But, <laughs> I'm going to do that, yeah? I'm going to focus on that, and that's the most important thing. Uh... Is Old World going to be a prequel like Warhammer Fantasy taking place in uh, during the time of Magnus Pius? It's taking place during the Age of the Free Emperors, so that means that it's going to be right before Magnus the Pious. So it should lead up to Magnus and so on, which I think is absolutely really cool. Uh, battle campaign, campaign. Okay, we've got a little bit more cash coming in, and I want to come down to here, so let's just bring ourselves here. This should hopefully be an island that we can fight and we can go from there. 
in terms of this location, we're doing okay. And here we can build up our guardhouse. So far, so good, guys. So far, so good. Maybe the second skill point unlocks the crossbow bolt. There were two points. Uh, the second one unlocks a um, elven steed, apparently. Have you seen that PH did a massive purge of content? PH? Yes, my lord. Yes, a sound Who is PH? Loud. Uh, oh, a great hoard of treasure may be received. Yep. Yeah. Easy enough to fight. Let's go in. See ya, Lehel. Have a good one, my dude. Hey, so far so good. And we are doing so far so good. And I'm feeling freaking good. So once I get back to shape, guys, this is the thing, right? So slowly, as you can see, you know, arms are starting to look good. You know, I've been doing minor workouts, but I'm trying to, I'm trying to get back into it. Once I get back into shape properly, today I was hitting it hard with some new kilos and stuff like that. I'm going to get that Skaven tattoo we voted about. It's going to be right here. It's going to be really fun. I've been waiting for it for a long time. Uh, hmm. What's the best name, the elves? What, uh, sorry. What about the na best name, the elves? There. No, God, no. Yeah. Heresy. Absolute heresy. What's that thing over here? Was Teclis Lawmaster the Free Emperor Spirit? Yeah, yeah. Teclis was around. Uh, they were all pretty much around. I wish Warhammer Old World was an alternative timeline where the Order Tide won against Archeon, destroyed uh, Chaos Presence. Yeah, we're not going to get that. We're not going to get that. That 18 plus website. Why would I know? <laughs> like, it's not the only website there, you know? But I guess they're probably... I, I saw something on the news that they were getting cancelled, you know? Nathan getting ready for his Gorich cosplay. That's why he's getting into shape. Damn right, man. Damn right. I do love the Vampire Coast guys, to be honest. I think their army is really interesting. Like, CA did a cracking job with the Vampire Coast. See you, Tim. Have a great one, yeah? Thanks for popping by. And let's bring these guys up. What, would you, what unit would you like to see for Pestilence? I know you're a fan of them. I'd be meaning to add in uh, another unique unit to give them a bit of a hand. Um, if you go on... There's a old school supplement. I could link it to you later if you want. And it has a lot of characters and a lot of units that were never added in. And I, uh, I just wish that Pestilence would have gotten a bit of love through those units. Because they are official. But I guess CA prefers the lesser clans. Which is a shame. I was sure that that body build story would end up in OnlyFans. I told you guys, 69k, yeah? 69k subscribers. Um, see ya, Linksy. Have a good one, my dude. Thanks for stopping by, yeah? I'll be sure to harass you later on. Thing is, uh, uh, Thomas, even if Archeon died, there would be another ever chosen. So... They could still happen. 
Is there a mod that makes pikes and spears work like in all, in other Total War games? I think that's how it's working now for um, for Southern Realms. Like you don't have any unit formations, but you can get unit formations. I mean, they're doing pretty well, except for this guy. And that guy bitch slapped the guy with the... Hey, you could just have a, a lot of upper, upper body strength. Do they still have firearms in the old world? Yes, by that point, that's when the steam tank would have been created. I should sleep. Then again, I'm not sure if I'll do, any, I'll do anything tomorrow, so why be well rested? Hey, you can stay here with us and celebrate the fact that we are at 25,000 subscribers. How fucking cool is that? Sorry, I'm just I'm gonna be really hyped about that today. Oh great, I love doing the lesser clans, but so far I've only got um, a uh, a clan rat reskin and a sensor bearer regiment around. Yeah, no worries, I'll link you to the uh, supplement. Yeah, but it's gonna be good, man. It's gonna be good. It's a good supplement. There was a Lord choice and everything, which. I hated that they phased out in 7th edition and then 8th. Because it's like, oh, you know, we could make Clan Rats core, or sorry, yeah, Plague Monk's core and had a proper faction, and, you know, that'd be cool. But yeah, that's, uh, I'm hoping to see some cool stuff. Chaos is Eternal. Pretty much, pretty much. There's a Pike sub mod by Chaos Robbie. You see, it's, it's freaking Chaos Robbie. That dude is just an absolute talent, isn't he? I would pay for an 8th and OnlyFans. Damn right. You see? I gotta shave though first. I am looking scruff. No overpowered stone fiends? Boy, please. <laughs> Those were one of my favorite units. Don't 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 harass them like that, yeah? They were good boys. They helped me win a lot of competitions. <laughs> uh does every single unit from Fantasy really have to be in the game? I feel like most of the factions have pretty good rosters already. I want as much as possible, man. I want as much as possible. I want I want the whole freaking Fantasy world. I, I, I want the world I grew up with being represented with all the stupid crap that even makes no fucking sense. You know? Because, damn right. This is probably going to be the only time we're going to see a game of this scale for War and Fantasy. So, the more the better. The more the freaking better. All I want for Christmas is for GW to actually deliver my shit. I don't tell me you're waiting for fucking um Are you waiting for um For Indominus or something? Oof. I, I hope it's not Indominus, because you might have to wait a while, my dude. Uh right, we're gonna have to fight him. I don't want to fight him just yet. He is building up. What I do want to do is I want to level up a little bit. Prepare myself over here so that way we, we know that we're financially safe. And we're going to start trying to get a few more islands. There's two over here that we could probably take well advantage of. Get some levels and then betray Marcus. I go back to 2nd edition for my Norska so I'm more than happy to use the older stuff. Oh, 2nd edition, that's freaking great. Do you think we will get uh, old world minis? Will be. Uh, do you think we will get old world minis? Twenty twenty one, twenty twenty two. I think close to the end of twenty twenty one. Probably close to the end of twenty twenty one. I think that's the one that makes the most sense. You're waiting for Black Library to send out books? Oof. They can be slow. The uh, sometimes emailing them is probably the best way to go. They are generally quite quick. But do bear in mind that obviously this COVID situation has been a bit strange. And no, I'm not acting as customer service for them. Uh, is this a fight? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, th this is another one that we can win. At least they've got, got fucking dogs this time. Uh, you want pygmies? Right, look, some things will be deleted. I do have pygmy models, though. I told you, I'm a collector. I've got, what, uh... If we go, like, by Skaven, I've got 300,000 points of Skaven. 
If you go by Warhammer Fantasy standards, I think I've got close to... 500,000 points? Outriders. Yeah, around 500,000 points. I love uh, I love Warhammer. I'm, well, I love Warhammer Fantasy. Uh, 40k and 30k are cool. I just take Mark and go... I'm, I'm gonna be nice. This is a day to celebrate. <laughs> but, um... You know, I, I prefer I prefer fantasy. I've always loved that game. Let's look what this um, weapon was. Did you get beefier? No. Oh, yeah, yeah, he does have the crossbow. Cool. Sky machine it. Uh, what is his, range? his range is fucking insane. Let's go use him. Yeah, I've got like three pending orders. Totally, total nine hundred dollars US. Uh, some of the three thirty days pending. Fuck, bro, give them a call. You'd pay for the um, for the OnlyFans, but if it was uh, if it was Nurgle, nah, God no, it's gonna be Suneshi, like pure Sunesh. I am determined to collect every single model that exists for Warhammer Fantasy Battle. Like I want one of everything. You have no idea how much this world means to me. This is why I, I wanted to create this content and uh, promote the um, Total War Warhammer. This, this is absolutely important um, world for me. It saved me from a lot of shit, believe me. So this world it means um, it means so much. It mean it literally means so much. That's why I want every single model. I collect fan art. I collect. Uh, Official art. I've got art that's older than I am. I've got models that are older than I am. I've even got lead minis. That crossbow is absolutely beautiful. Like, it's pretty damn good. And look, look, look at that fucking range. That's pretty good. Have you seen the Sigmar's Airs mod? Uh, I don't think I have. I've got to check it out if that's the case. Incredibly racist stereotypes. Bear in mind that a lot of factions in Warhammer are considered incredibly racist uh, stereotypes. Believe it or not. If you look at it properly, then yeah, you, you'd notice that. Um, where are we? If we? I hope we get a Sunesh. Uh, we get Sunesh. We'll get a proper cult of Sunesh. Pleasure with devoted Sunesh units, anointed Druki, and so on. If we don't, uh, we will end up getting, if we don't, we will, we will end up getting freaking, um, like some talented modder is just going to decide to make it himself. We, we all know this. And that would be kind of cool anyway. Uh, where are we here? Does your metal band have some sort of music video on YouTube? We've got some live clips, but I'm not going to share those. Just wait until the, the uh, we're going to have the proper music video coming out soon. Like something, it, we've been working on it. I've did some post production on something. We have to refilm some parts. Uh, it's it's kind of annoying that we have to do that. In all honesty, but hey, these things do happen. But we've got something cool coming up. Uh, where is the Chaos War Mammoth from Tamilcon? Yeah, those were great minis, weren't they? Those were freaking great minis. Um, where were we here? I'd pay to get the only fan shut down. More master, please. I'm just saying, you know, I, I, I'm a, I'm a good-looking chap. But I'm also, um, I'm very, um, you know, I, I, uh, I can't, I can't, I can't do that stupid, uh, self-righteous, all up my ass type of thing. <laughs> um, did you ever play uh, Epic Forty Thousand? Yeah, I played Epic. I've got a bunch of Epic minis. I played. Um, the original, uh, what was the one in space that keeps uh, gothic? I've got War Master minis and everything. Uh, it's kind of funny that in Warhammer Fantasy you feel kept uh, that they have more memorable characters than 40k. Yeah, because in 40k they just get very shit plot points and die out within days. Every faction is a stereotype. Exactly. Uh, where are we going here? Uh, I have uh, models older than I am. Well, given the fact that you're 15, that isn't hard. I'm actually 28, dude. 
I'm actually 28. Just to take great care of myself, you know. I can't. No, I can't. Sorry. Uh, where are we here? I did miss something. Christopher Columbus and invading North America. Uh, 25k success in the subscribers. Uh, congrats, Grudge. Thank you, Medjay. Thank you. I should probably be paying attention to the battlefield. All right, they're breaking anyway. That's fine. What metal, uh, metal do you play? The current band that I'm working on is kind of like Mellow Death slash Black Metal. It's been great to scream into the microphone again. Nakari was six, uh, six double Ds. I mean, only the best content, yeah? Only the best content. Future on Warhammer's console? No, it's been on the uh, console for a while, but um, that's not the future. The future is the tabletop. Then it's PC gaming, then it's console. Alright, uh, did I miss anyone here? I'm sorry if I've missed anyone. Uh, yeah, Holgun1000, congratulations to 25k. Are you wiping, I mean, negotiating with the natives of Austria? Yes, I am. If I do miss your messages, guys, just make sure to repeat it. Just saying that again, because obviously there's a lot of messages going out, and you know, I'm half useless as it is. 50% armor piercing. Ooh, that's actually quite a good. I might start working on my own dudes. Uh, income from ports. Casualties captured. I do want that though. No, we're not fighting humans at the moment. So. Oh, okay. Befriend the priest, befriend the stuff. We can really get into good graces with these guys, can't we? Let's do that. I know you're 28, uh, you old fart, but on a psychological level, you're 15. Hey, still probably the nicest thing you said to me. <laughs> Nate, if uh, Ratfin was to die, does that uh, does the Horn Rat or Sanesh torment his soul for eternity? Probably Sanesh. Unless the Horn Rat can be fast enough. Yeah, probably Sanesh. I think Sanesh devours souls like almost instantly. Yeah, let's come up this way. I don't think there's any other islands, so we'll just come up this way. Um... I mean, we have the money, so let's just build these up, and then we'll start invading. So we'll do this. Very well. <sighs> really hate okay. these. He's got all the characters there too. Captain, swashbucklers. Do I not have any big gunners? Oh Christ! This roster is small. Um. Back. All right, uh, right, we can get guns, but the crossbows seem to work the best for me. I do want a captain, though, because I do want a hero to support this character. And we'll go from there. So, yeah, Medjay, have a good one. All Sineshi units should have massive boobs. Uh, male, female, or whatever. Don't know if you'll see my message. No, they have to have one and missing the other. You gotta go for the real Sinesh look. You gotta go for the real Sinesh look. Uh, do you think we'll ever see Araby? I think so. I think so. The problem is I see why people want to avoid it, like CA and GW, but... Look, I'm a big fan of the lore. Like, I know people are gonna be all like, Oh, you know, it's racist. It's like, it's not racist, it's a fantasy world. And I've spoken to Muslim creators who want Araby. Uh, military Alliance, no, I don't trust you. Where are we here? Nathan likes it when people humiliate him. It's kink of his, of course. We're a team. Where are the green skin, <laughs> green skin cheerleaders, grudgy? I don't know, man. Fucking Venris doesn't give me what I want. 
He's supposed to be my fucking friend. Uh, let's get rid of that. And Venris, if you're here, fuck you. <laughs> oh, same by as uh, Thomas. Sorry about that. Uh, I'm just trying to keep up with the chat. I don't normally get this going too quickly. Uh, Ethan Bird. Uh, opinions on naval combat. Dude, won it. Desperately. Don't mind waiting until third game because we'd have to wait till everything here. Um, uh, every race appears and so on. But it needs to happen. I think a lot of people in the community would want it. And... I think it's important for that. I don't know. Oh, it's so expensive. Is there not another island thing? No. Okay. Well, I mean, there is one, but it's pretty damn far away. We can go up there. Let's, wait. Let's go up that way. I want naval combat. I want everything. I want every established thing in one fantasy. I don't know why you guys aren't too keen about the Blood Bowl, um, the Greenskin Cheerleaders. I think they look great, and they dance like, uh, you know? You, have a proposal? We are willing to hear it. you guys say you don't want it, but then when I release a four-hour video on <laughs> Greenskin Cheerleaders. Uh, let me just keep on going with the chat. Sorry, I have to actually scroll up. Damn, this is going so quick. I don't know how Slanesh is considered hot. I mean, it's Slanesh. It's uh, more sensual than anything else. That's so cringe. Uh, where are we here? As long as they're not mocking Islam, which will have what was the problem with Arabi? Some people will use the game to mock it, you know? Uh, that's the problem. There's a lot of people who basically go full edgelord. And you know when, uh, when you think about school back in the day? When your teacher would go, it always takes one idiot to ruin, every, uh, ruin it for everyone else. That's precisely what they all teacher means. Congrats on the four, uh, 25k. Do you have any plans for when you get to 40k? I'm not too sure just yet. <laughs> I'll be very honest. I never. You know what my target was for this year? 3,500 subs. So I'm in this state of like... Oh, game just went a little framey there. Oof. I fucked up. Okay. Let's hope for the best. Oh, where are we here? When it comes to Araby, they just need a good pantheon of gods. Yeah, pretty much. <coughs> I would love for... Um... You smash your target. Yeah, I did. I did. I... I um... Yeah, like I was growing about uh, around 100 subs a month. And I was like, well, you know, I could probably try and push it up a bit and so on. <laughs> and the next thing I know, you know? See you, Noldo. Have a good one. All right, I think you mean, uh, yeah, my humans, yeah. I'm gonna try and see if I can do this like, like Legend does. I, I doubt it, but, but I mean it's worth a fucking try, isn't it? Plus we got this boy who can shoot whilst he moves and so on, so we might as well. And you know, it, it's 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 a super weird thing. 
being able to uh... COVID. Well, not so much COVID. I actually started really expanding my growth prior to COVID. It was super weird. Like two months before COVID started, I, I, I randomly started getting a lot of, of views and I was like, what the fuck is going on? Then as COVID was starting, that did help. And then obviously uh, being friends with Major Kill, which was really funny, right? Because um, we started being friends. <laughs> we started being friends because he said I have an annoying squeaky voice and I told him to go fuck himself or something like that. And I guess that's what starts a beautiful friendship. Hey, the hand man, how are you doing? Uh, let's bring you guys up this way. I look like... Who the fuck is Ben Shapiro? Bear in mind, guys, I don't watch TV or anything, so... Pinches gringos siempre con los mejores, uh, mejores mods. Bueno, si es un mod de... Técnicamente español, ¿no? Your mod coverage is a pretty, is a pretty big selling point. Yeah, I'd, I'd say so. I like I, I enjoy I enjoy covering mods because I think that the modding community deserves a shit ton more love than it gets, and I think uh, well they're getting a lot of stuff from CA now, but like uh, they deserve a lot more. They deserve a lot more. Uh, I I'm trying to I I'm trying to be. Um, I'm trying to be uh, as accessible as possible in terms of content. I hope people like the stuff, you know, that's that's my main thing. Are you close to making it a career? Uh, nah, not just yet. If I could have <coughs> more or less the views that I get with a DLC launch, then possibly. But... Um, But I, I don't think that I'm going to be able to get that type of viewership a lot, you know? He speaks in tongues. No, sometimes people come in and randomly say something in Spanish. And it like I like to freak them out by replying in Spanish. Because I think they don't realize uh, I'm uh, Gibraltarian. So it, it actually it is really funny to me. What the fuck is going on here? Go that way. He's a politician? Oh, no, I don't want to look like any politician. Listen, I look cute as a button, and that's the only, um... That's the only thing I'll take from that, yeah? Just say I look cute like a button. Okay, I think we're gonna win this. I'm actually quite surprised we're doing quite well. I don't know who this guy is. I might have to Google it. Yeah, let's not uh, let's not put any political stuff down here. Yeah, guys, like uh, this is a Warhammer chat, so Warhammer, hammer the wars. This bastard's not gonna die, is he? My name is also Nathan, so I keep trying to figure out how the chat learned my name. Hey, we got another Nathan. See? We're the coolest ones, yeah? I predict this channel will be 50k next year. That would be kind of cool, wouldn't it? Uh, no, no. I, I don't sweet... Uh, I, I think you said uh, sweet... Uh, Dutch? Um... 
You look like a cute political button, fuck's sake. What mods are you using? I'm using the Southern Realms mod, which is taking me into Lustria as the New World Colonies, which is really, really cool. I'll Google it to see what this dude looks like, because I have no idea what you guys are talking about. It's making me really confused. I don't think CA would be support so supportive of mods until the uh, game free was out. Seems like big steps since their first game. Yeah, they're doing much better. They're doing much better. Um, I, I want to support these modders myself. I love covering these mods. I get these modders messaging me. It's like, oh, I've been working on this. Do you mind covering it? It's like, uh, it's like, yeah, man. Like, what is it? Like, tell me about your mod. They're like, oh, you seem to, you seem really accessible. It's like, look, it's. Believe me, after a massive, uh, after, a, like, I used to play a lot of vanilla, right? And then after experiencing the content drought a few, not this DLC, but a few DLCs ago, I realized how damn important modders are. Like, Christ, without them, this game would have died a long time ago. This fuckface is not going to die. Another Nathan reporting in. You see, we've only got all the cool ones, right? We've only got all, only only real chads are called Nathan. Uh, from the film Matilda. Uh, well, don't be disappointed, but I don't think I've ever seen that fucking film. <laughs> right, yeah, they're gonna start doing some damage now, but I think we're at the point that we can start doing this. So, what's so special about this character? This is not Christopher Columbus. Marco Colombo is not Christopher Columbus in not any way. Uh, no matter what GW tried to say originally, because obviously they, things have changed. They're not. Uh, they don't have any problems. <laughs> yeah, uh, it's basically yeah. So it's uh, it's Warhammer Christopher Columbus. Um, there we go. Is OVN running too? Yeah, OVN's running. I've got Mixus Legendary Lords and loads of other stuff. Where are we here? Um, I'm missing a lot of stuff. Like a lot of people chatting. Nathan Gang Assemble. Exactly. Damn right. Is Big Boy... Yeah, Big Boy's not dead yet, is he? Why am I- oh god, I'm in fucking slow motion. Mods made Total War. Yeah, essentially mods made Total War. I, I, I can admit that too, it's, it's really important for that, you know? Uh, where are we over here? I was wondering why I was doing so well. I was like, oh, wow, well, I'm, I'm microing extremely well. Combined with Marco Polo. Yeah, yeah. But, like, that's it. Yeah, it was just me. I completely... I don't know why. At least we're winning. It's, it's Marco, uh, Marco Colombo and, and the detective, I think. Yeah. I mean, they, they've got freaking characters like Obi-Wan, Gusto, and stuff like that. Rip Cavalry, yeah, but I mean, can we just kill this fucking bastard? Shoot it. Shoot it. Where's Marco? Right. He's not dying. I'm gonna have to try and bring that there. He's gone. There are a few famous uh, dwarf females. We are covering a few in a few videos soon. Don't you worry about that. Marco Polo invented, invented po po uh, pools. Can modders add more to the campaign map or is it hard-coded? It's uh, hard-coded, but people have... 
It's uh, uh, people have done it with another game. I think they did it with Artilla, uh, Artilla, where they've been able to fix up the map and change it to their own stuff. I'm not sure if that's possible here, but it proves once again the competence of the modders, doesn't it? Es como Cristóbal Colón. Sí, no, eso es eso lo que es, porque es Cristo Cristóf Colombo, es Cristo Cristóbal Colón. There's a little bit more Spanish for you guys. It's gonna be a ferric victory, yeah, but at least we've won. And all I wanted this was some so was for uh, for some extra cash. I just didn't think I was gonna take a beating. At least he's gonna level, which I guess works in our favor. Right, they're breaking. I just joined, and you said Star Wars, did I? Yeah, yeah, there's some famous dwarf women. We're going to be covering that soon. Uh, just one second here. Just making sure everything's fine. Ah. Like, damn, we're having a really super fast chat today. I'm like, I'm trying to keep up. I'm like, fuck. <laughs> did you ever watch Time Commander? Yeah, I did. I used to freaking love watching that show. Yes, All right, we've got that. That's given us... Yeah, I mean, look at our cash now. We're ready. Now, all I need is this, so we can actually start invading them properly. And we'll start fighting Marcus Wolfhart. I think we're doing well. I think we're doing quite well. Are you from Spain? You've got a really good accent. I'm from Gibraltar, so I'm, I'm born in Spain. Uh, Gibraltarians have mixed blood between uh, British and Spaniards. Listen, the best mod, the Duke, is literally that one. Uh, what was it? Beautiful Greenskins. <laughs> now, let us move. So it's like the Rock of Gibraltar, your king? Or, nah, it's just this giant rock that we all kind of just go ooka bugger around. You know, like that? Just set things on fire? Nah, nah. Uh, it's, um, the rock is kind of like, um... How do I explain it? It's kind of like our symbol, in a sense. Yeah, it's kind of like our symbol. There's a whole shit show between Britain and Spain and sieges and fuckery and so on. Hey, Noob Nafe, how you doing, my dude? So. I do prefer the whole thing of all of us just going around the fucking rock and just making random noises. Uh, one more time. I'm gonna have a quick cigarette though, because it's been an hour and 20 minutes, so we're gonna turn off the camera for just a little bit, because obviously I don't like smoking on camera. Oh, we've actually got a lot of people watching today. Wow, God, that's awesome. I guess, oh yeah, Legend took a day off today, didn't he? That shit show with YouTube going down for like two hours was scary as fuck, man. <laughs> Get rid of the med. Yeah, we're, we're a weird place. We're a weird place. Yeah, the Vortex has too many timelines, uh, time limits. I, I'm not a fan of it myself. Okay, so we're doing well for once, which is a fucking rare thing. Let's get some mortars. Oh, we're going to have to keep crossbows, aren't we? Actually... I don't want to get rid of good shit. Uh, okay, I know handgunners are good, but I always shit up the... Uh, we're going to get rid of one. Oh, son of a bitch. Let's just keep doing this, yeah? You're supposed to stop. Hey, one hour and 20 minutes is not bad, considering I normally take an hour. So, I'm doing better. I'm doing better. 
We need heavier armed troops, but I have a feeling that we're not going to get any. Great sword infantry, which isn't too bad. Eighty minutes is important for me. It's actually not too bad. Are the Rock and uh, Dwayne the Rock Johnson related? Uh, I don't think so. I might just replace those with those. What we're going to do is we're going to do that. And yeah, I'm going to replace these spearmen. What does the Emperor bid? With Sigma. spearmen with shields. And we'll go from there. Is Brexit affecting you? Uh, I like to keep away from politics. I am a Warhammer YouTuber, not a politician. Oh shit, I was going to Google this uh, Ben Shapiro guy though. Not because of politics, but his... Uh... I want to see if this... Because you guys keep saying I look like him. Shapiro. Guys, this bloke's fucking ugly, please. Plus, how can you look simultaneously 12 and 50 at the same time? Fuck, people, please, why? Uh, tribute, yeah, let's do a tribute over here. Uh, what were you saying? Swashbucklers and pikemen? How do I recruit uh, pikemen, though? I'm not getting access to them. Oh, I do have access to them, but I need a fucking armory. Um, we'll get rid of that then, and we'll build that, and we'll get rid of that. Um, are the spearmen with shields not worth it, then? Because they're quite decent. Oh, I see the armor. Yeah, okay. We'll get rid of this one, then, too. I quite like these crossbowmen. Problem is just getting half these buildings. Where are we gonna supposed to get those? Fantasy politics is fine. Fantasy politics is fine. It's Nathan right after he is 30. No god no, please. Uh like, please. Oh, yeah, we're going to have to start recruiting freaking regiments right now, aren't we? Uh, can I not get more of these um, shielded guys? I'll Google that Ty Lopez guy as soon as I'm done. Nathan's like 40, dude. Dude, I'm freaking 28. Ready. Uh, we'll get more of these pikemen and we'll wait for that. I don't want freaking... Oh, yeah, we have to wait, don't we? How big he is. Where are these pikemen? I know we had pikemen available. Okay, no, we need the smithies. Which means we have to wait a ton. You can be prepared and chaos can still appear for uh, far from your armies and destroy a bunch of settlements. Uh, hmm? What was that about? Also, the webcam is gone. Yeah, it's coming back now. It's just I don't like to have the webcam on when I smoke. Because uh, I have younger viewers and I don't like to be a bad impression. A bad um, influence. Physical resistance, that works out well. We have to wait uh, three turns, so that's perfectly fine. I'll build this up so we can get a witch hunter. Hmm. Yeah, we'll get that. We'll get that. And then we're going to start getting ready for that. Are there any uh, law reasons why dwarfs get... Uh, why border princes get dwarf units? So, uh, basically what happens is some... Ty Lopez. Who is this? I have no idea who these people are, man. I have no idea who these people are. Uh, let's just go this way. Uh, I'm back, guys. <laughs> like, you, you guys are telling me these celebrities, and I'm like, who? Uh, we have to wait for that, but we can get our thingy. 
So basically what happens is some dwarves want their fortunes and they'll work for the border princes because they know they have money. That's literally just it. Uh, Nathan, uh, what? Nathan is my daddy. Blood or sugar? Why not both? Because, well, that's incest. And second, what? Nathan, you're already a bad influence. So I like, I like to think that I'm a positive outlook in the series, right? There's a lot of, um... There's a lot of, like, you know, different people. They, 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 some of them are negative, some of them are like that. I like to be a positive outlook on the series. I want to be a positive outlook on Total War in general. Uh, you didn't answer my question on politics and the Empire. Uh, can you repeat that for me, please? Oh. How are politics of the Empire? Is Boris still trying to bring down Karl Franz? No, after a while he started to respect Franz. Hype for Kathy? I really hope so. I, I hope it's right, you know? Yeah, they're going to milk this game fucking dry. We, we can all be aware of that, which is a good thing. Um, I think that CA are doing an ass, absolute, uh, ass, <laughs> absolute awesome job. Um, so I, th I think they're doing all right, man. I think they're really doing all right. And they're going to milk this as much as freaking possible. Which, you know, they can milk it as much as they want because this is... It's, make, it's making a dream come true, I guess, you know? Europeans on the internet usually go who, what, where. I, I don't know who half these celebrities are, you know? I'm not much of a TV guy, if that helps. I'm pretty much in the, um... I'm pretty much in the whole thing of like, ah, uh, yeah, you know, I like, um... I like Warhammer, and... That's it. <laughs> yeah, I'm a boring dude. I'm a boring dude. I don't want to be a bad influence on kids with smoking. Instead, I'll introduce them to Warhammer, which is arguably more expensive and causes as many health problems due to diabetes. <laughs> Fuck's sake. <laughs> I mean, like, look, I'm a skinnyish dude, you know? Which I was a bit more muscly, but then again, that was my own fault. Probably healthier to smoke while having minis. Not resin, though. Not resin. Estalia was destroyed. See, look, I lasted 70 fucking turns. They lasted 44. Well, upset the refugees. Alright, we're cool here, we're cool here, we're cool here. How are we doing over here? Can we declare war? We need six turns, that's perfectly fine. That means that we can wait a little bit. Whilst we're doing that, we can just keep building up over here. That's cool. We've got our army. Is a new island up and running? No. Father Nathan, what's your favorite lizardman lord in law? I'm a big fan of um, Krokgar. My favorite Lizardman, however, is Oxyotl. I think he's an absolute badass. Yeah, we're gonna have to come down this way. See, so yeah, was have been so successful that they made Games Workshop go back to the old world setting. I mean, damn, yeah. If you if you aren't much of a TV guy, then you can't be a. Tra uh, 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 oh God, I I just read what you were saying. Rip. <laughs> to the provinces. Yes, a sound plan. Enjoy Blood Bowl, beep boop. We're gonna raid them whilst we can. Um, we can get Lupio. And El Cadavo is already here. Oh, you can recruit El Cadavo from the start. That's actually not too bad. Construction cost minus 33%. That's actually not too bad. Merchant Prince in general. Should we recruit another Lord? I'll wait for you guys to decide. Should we get another Lord? You have a proposal? We are willing to hear it. He wants a military alliance? Nope. 
Why do you want to go to Mar uh, war with Marcus Wolfhart? Because uh, as far as I see, Mar uh, Marco, po uh, Marco Polo, Marco Colombo's um, faction traits give you quite good diplomatic bonuses with the lizards. So as you can see, I'm at 101 with Mazda Mundi and 90 with this boy over here. So I've been like, and I've seen over here that I'm just pretty low anyway. So I was like, well, you know, I could just build up and chill. But Pepper Mundi, what? Ready. All right, we can do some research. We're doing okay. Income from Rainy would actually do us quite good. Leadership for all characters. Oh, shit. Uh, yeah, leadership for all characters. That will work out for the best for me. Yeah, I did play the RP. It wasn't too much of my thing, but I always try out anything that's Warhammer Fantasy related. Do you have a video on the Lizardmen Legendary Lords added by Mixu? Not just yet, not just yet. I've got to get it sorted. Right, she wants a trade agreement. You know what? We're in the ocean, why not? Oh, wait, did she kill Astalia? Weird. Are you supposed to get gunpowder? Uh, I think we got two cannons. Yeah, we'll build up a second army, you know? We'll get him. And we'll recruit. Oh, we'll have to come up this way, but we'll recruit some gunpowder units, which... Are fairly expensive, if we can be very completely honest, but I think we should be fine. I'm determined not to lose this campaign. Wow, Columbus is actually in Warhammer as a Spaniard. It's kind of weird. <coughs> I mean, it's cool, isn't it? Like, uh, it was always a really cool character. I've got the minis myself. They were always, like, a favorite of mine. Hello, most noble lizard men. Would you like this large crate of blankets? Uh, I guess that's how it went. Would Croak be dead, undead, or alive during the new Old World setting? Uh, he'd still be undead. Let's just get a few gunners. And how long do we have? Two turns, yeah. So we'll get two more gunner units and then we'll declare war. I found on Google that in uh, it, that in first edition there was a regiment of renowned miniature that you could order from the catalogs called the Temple Dogs that were from Cafe. Yeah, Cafe and the Nippon had some uh, had some miniatures way back in the day though. Which is more expensive, Warhammer or Magic the Gathering? Uh, Magic the Gathering. I, I think there's cards that go for like tens of thousands, aren't there? Which is absolutely fucking insane, but then again, who am I to judge anyone's uh, hobbies? <coughs> Should you buy Warham uh, Total War Warhammer 2? Yes. It's an absolutely fantastic game. I love this like game dearly. It's so much better than game 1. It has so many extra races. Game 1 and game 2 fuse together with all their DLC too. I highly recommend it. And like it is my favorite game it is literally my favorite game i spent hours beyond hours talking about it all my contents basically focused around it and i can't see myself playing anything else in all honesty it's really difficult to actually play a different game without getting bored and thinking about total war Warhammer. it's kind of cool also the units seem to uh, seem similar to what we used to have yeah so basically Warhammer Fantasy is based on our world, so everything is always going to be very similar. A little bit of Spanish. Did Morafi get destroyed? Hello, I think you're probably right about uh, the DLC. It will be tied to the Dark Elves. Yeah, I, I think so. It just it makes the most sense to me. Right, let's start causing some shit over here. We're going to start fighting Marcus. Come on. This might be a mistake. 
Yep, okay, cool. Bring El Cadavo over here. Wait, magic has expensive cards? I'm regretting throwing away that massive stack I was given. Yeah, they they uh, get super fucking rare, dude. Like, whew, yeah. All right, let's get some basic units. We might as well start getting some, some ooh, swashbucklers. Up. Why do they have 268 uh, upkeep? Like, they don't look that good. I might just go for some turtles and pirates. Yeah, we'll try that. Now, he's leveled. I kind of want to buff him up a bit more. But I also want to get this. So, I know we're going to be fighting... Nothing of use. Maybe Skaven, so we'll get that. We'll build this up. And wait for that. Uh, where are we over here? Your vote, what Nicholas said. What did I miss over here? Are there any Warhammer Fantasy Assassin-like factions beside Eshin? Yeah, Nippon. Nippon would have assassins and so on. Oh, look, we have Alvaro Martinez, which I'm assuming is a legendary hero. It's a captain. Port Reaver. I mean, it kind of seemed like it, didn't it? They're not going to update that uh, that much. It, it would be insane for them to even try. Okay, let's go up this way. I can't believe Morafi was killed. I honestly can't believe Morafi was killed. Right, so he's got a Lord of uh, Fire Lord and the High Elf. That's just a Warrior Priest. Oh, fuck. Wow, it looks... Hey, Concealed Coffee got affiliate. Nice. That's a good lad. I'm proud of him. He's doing very well. Yeah, but if you mean like Assassin Faction, Nippon pretty much is a mix of both. We're going to just do this. Mainly because I was just fucking fed up with dealing with... Uh, with my... Oh, Christ. Right, okay. Techless? What, what, what's going on with this game? I mean, Techless is up here. Um, how much territory do you own? Free. What's going on? Uh, you. There. Clan Scry has got five. Dreadfleet's got one. I can see Karak Norn for some reason. The Amazons are here. With Dryker, apparently. Okay, we're okay. And we need... Uh, there was one for Dark Elves, wasn't it? Yeah. We'll probably start making our way up north. I mean, we might have to turn around and start fighting them. Oh. Interesting. You got the whole law based on that. That's actually pretty cool. Commandment available. Growth. Go for that. Will they add new regions in Nagaron? Yeah, I think they might do. But they might add it in different areas. It just really depends. Uh, doesn't the Empire even have an Assassin's Guild? Yeah, I mean, a lot of factions will need Assassins, so they will train them up as much as possible. I'm told a lot of high elf victories are happening in Manila currently as the Dark Elves have more problems than ever with the sisters there. Oh, okay. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. However... I mean, Mazda Mundi pushed up quite... Yeah, look, I mean, yeah. Mazda Mundi went direct to her capital. That's super weird. Uh, what factions, uh, racist factions, do you guys think Warhammer 3 will add? Uh, Demons of Chaos, Chaos Dwarves, all that type of stuff. There's a lot of stuff that's still missing, and I am hoping that we will see it. No, don't you 
not my mission. Okay. That should, in theory, be fine. Sigma compelled us. And now, yes. can I be sneaky? By Sigma's right now. I should be sneaky. Let's see if this works, yeah? Oh, I forgot about Alvaro. Whoops. Shogun is still very popular. I know Mr. Smart Donkey still covers it a lot. I'll be very honest, I wanted to cover a bit of Shogun and a bit of uh, Roman stuff, but I just don't have the time. I honestly don't have the time. And Marco failed. Okay, that's fine. Venris Kingdoms for Warhammer 3. I've told him that I'm going to learn to mod specifically for this, right? When they add in the Ogre Kingdoms, not if, but when... I will be there, and I will make a Venris mod. Where is Marco? Thing is, it wouldn't be too much like playing Shogun, though, because it would be Japan with monsters and magic and stuff like that, you know? I really want Araby. I want everything. I want literally as much as humanly possible. I know that's a bit of an unrealistic thing to ask for, but, you know, I can ask. Where, where? Um, there he is. How should we proceed? Faction Encounters, Cult of Sotek. Wouldn't both Nippon and Cafe be redundant? No, actually, um, how it works is that um, the strongest empire was known as Grand Imperial Cafe, yeah? And Nippon itself. Hey, Will Rock. Sorry, I didn't see you there, dude. And there's... Okay. Yeah, all right. <laughs> and the uh, strongest navy... Oh, Christ, look at that. Okay, yeah, why not? Uh, the strongest navy was known as Nippon. The problem is that Nippon was such an isolationist that was just... We never see them. There's a guy who edited the table names for the Skaven Elves and Dark Elves to be more all friendly. Uh, there's men. Should I ask him? Oh, well, yeah, will do. But I'm, I'm learning how to mod. I'm learning how to mod. I've been learning little by little. About to start a campaign. Suggestions? Um, have you played the... Oh, I'm sure you've played it. The Kislev mod is absolutely fantastic. It's probably one of my favorites. Ah, I love a good choke point. Literally just up here. Plop your troops like this. Put a shit ton of crossbows behind. Add it in with some mortars. I'm good, I'm good. How are you? And chill. Let's just bring him up here so he can just fuck about up there for a bit. Is there any faction you don't want? Um, to be honest, no. Not as far as I'm aware. You can stop um, Archeon, but you can't stop Archeon and Grimgore's love for shiny figs. True, true. Oh, got some yawning a little bit there. I think the... Uh, the come down from training is now taking effect. But when in doubt, more Red Bull. Go. Actually, we can bring these guys up here, can't we? Let's bring El Cadavo up here. Quick I'm saying it really English, El Cadavo. Yeah, I've just updated my sub mod with, uh, for kids that were watching this. It's a good faction. It's a really good faction. I think it was done extremely well. Oh, shit. I forgot it's Marcus. He's a sniper, isn't he? Fuck off. One spell would destroy that. Yeah. I've got no spellcasters, though. I want Chaos Dwarves.
Which of the missing factions would you not miss uh, the most in Warhammer 3? Uh, it's the thing, like, I, I want as much as possible. Nah, uh, that's not War that's not Warhammer. That's um that's fan fiction. Marcus, fuck off, mate. I love how they're just standing there, so I'm just fucking firing. They've actually got halflings, don't they? They had halflings. Marcus, fuck off. Do they not have halflings? This is why I absolutely love the uh, modding community. They, they can get so much done. I mean, if they want to wait. Yeah, that's great. Let's just, because we're just going to get fired. They're trying to just meet up with these guys, which is perfectly fine in my opinion. Because by the time they actually start moving, the damage has been done. Look. Look at that. They're just bunching up right here. Ice cold even. Uh, bad joke was bad. Ooh, game got framey there. Marcus, fuck off. He does so much damage, it's insane. Halflings are stalking? Alright, yeah, that makes a lot more sense, doesn't it? Should be somewhere here, shouldn't they? Alright, let's just do this. See what we can do. Uh, I wonder if we'll get Halflings versus Ogre Factions DLC together. That would be fun. Yeah, that'd be kind of cool, wouldn't it? Yep, those are the Stalkers. I mean, they look good, don't they? They're not perfect, but, like, considering what was available... These guys are firing. We're going to bring these guys into the fray. A cadaver is taking his sweet ass time to do some damage. You know what would make Farkas fuck off? Some Stormcast Eternals. No Stormcast allowed. Fucking Stormies. These missile arcs are making you shut up. I mean, they're doing damage, man. They're doing damage. And hey, I was never... I never promoted myself for being competent in the game. <laughs> I need to just have fun. I found a person who makes uh, non-law friendly legendary laws for fun. I kind of want to learn how to do it. Try and make Tyrion Four drink. Hey, why not? But then you'd have to make a death knight and then try to raise him and seems like a lot of work. <laughs> Why dwarves are so proficient in rune magic when besides chaos dwarves stu they suck at spell casting? I mean chaos dwarves are also uh, proficient at, at rune casting too. Uh, rune magic. It's just because they are naturally able to work closer to the runes. Anyone seen those Forge World Chaos Dwarf units used in the tabletop? I have an army of them. I'm very proud of that army. Because it's actually one of those few armies that I finished painting. And I'm very happy with the paint scheme. It was actually the first time I started working on custom um, bases too, with cork on the, um, on the flat surface and all that shit. You know, give it the stereotypical fire look. I see uh, CA at most adding a halfling regiment around to the Empire as a unique artillery crew. Mm, could be cool. But I, I prefer a full faction, if I could be completely honest. What, what, what's going on here? Why do they always run that way? 
Um, freaking. No, Chris is a good player. Forget that they. Uh, that's how they shoot in vanilla. I mean, the crossbows. Yeah, they always shoot up, don't they? Which is super weird because it's still a. It's tech. It's still technically a bolt weapon. You know. Shouldn't really have a arc upwards. And a very expensive army. Yep, I got that. Uh, when did I get that army? I was really happy about it. It was a long time ago. It was when the Tamil Khan book came out. And I remember I, I wanted to treat myself for something. I, I think there was something about it. And it was just like, damn, you know? Absolutely loved it. It's one of those armies, you know, that you can just look at and you go, damn, that's cool. Um, why are we talking about Chaos Dwarves? Give the poor uh, forgotten Chaos Elves some uh, love too. I mean, Halibron's already in the game and she joined up with Chaos. Uh, where are we doing? Lovely to hear it. How am I doing? The proper description won't fit onto uh, into YouTube chat, but I'm doing better than last time, so then that's important. That's great, dude. Uh, yeah, we're doing damage. They're going to be breaking soon. I think this was his capital, yeah? Oh, Kadabo wasn't too bad. He's a bit of a duelist, isn't he? Oh, yeah, he's got dirty fighters, doesn't he? Yeah. Where were we here? Uh, Spuds, I've returned. I got the job over my, f over my phone interview, but I spilled uh, coffee, so tit for that. Well, congrats on the job, my dude. Very well done. I'm absolutely getting sick of Marcus. He's not breaking. His units are, but he's not. But that's awesome, dude. Well done on the new job. Yeah, they're breaking. Okay, this is ours. I hope Venris can make Clan Molder OP again. See a nerf laboratory too much? Did they release a patch? Did they? I thought that would have broken mods again. Or are you part of the program? Oh, I thought we were actually taking the, um... I thought we were taking the city. I completely forgot. I honestly thought they sallied out. Oh, they nerfed... They nerfed... Um, cellular explosion. Eh. It was getting a bit cheesy. Okay, so... We know he's got that. He's got fuck all over there. Floating Pyramid is not that defendable. How many territories do you own? One. By that logic, he's most than likely going to come down here. So what we're going to do is move up this way. Now, we are going to befriend the Lizardmen again. Yeah, we're going to befriend the Lizardmen again. and go from down. Total War 2020, COVID-19. My biggest mistake in Warhammer, when I stopped collecting, I gave away a full unit of unpainted chooch again. Oh, Christ. Bruh. Did that guy buy you dinner at least or something? Like... Damn. I will marshal the best. Raise your weapons. Absolutely not. Right, once we're loading in, I'm gonna go get a second Red Bull. Because I desperately need one today. So I'll be back in just a sec, guys. I'm gonna make sure because I'm getting random messages. There we go.
okay, I hope you guys enjoyed my chair. It was very pretty. Uh. I feel sorry for whatever poor bastard faction gets paired up with Fanquil in game three. Rip. Didn't tell me what they were worth. Sister's husband. Oh, so he's still in your life. Okay. Um, eat him. Christ, that's like scamming family. See you, Jig Have a good one. Uh-huh. A bit of damage over here. You know, I was going to cover Necromunda today, and then I saw the fucking um, reviews for the new DLC. I was like, you know what? Maybe not cover that piece of shit game. These guys are taking a while to arrive. Fuck it, if Nathan's getting a Red Bull, you're getting Coke. Why not? Why not? I mean, we pretty much... Uh, we're doing so much damage here, it's insane. Can we take... Can Marco go in? Like, is that Marcus? No, it's not. Right. I'm not too worried then. Because if it was Marcus, I'd be a bit more concerned. Yeah, they're, they're properly breaking. Hey, Tom, how are you doing? Hey, Dalaka, how are you doing? Uh, Necromunda on the Hive Wars. I did, like, I, I wanted to play it, and then I saw the reviews for the DLC that dropped today. I was like, oof. No. Not gonna do that. Like, I really wanted to give that sec that game a second chance. But again, they, act a they had a lackluster DLC with ba barely anything new. The AI is as stupid as ever, apparently. It's like, okay, cool. Let's let's play that. I guess uh, never hit more, uh, uh, Mordheim quality? Yeah, it's still not Mordheim quality. Which is, to, to me, is a sad thing. Because if Mordheim is the best they can do, which, let's face it, is still kind of shitty. Despite the fact that I do love that game with all my heart, by the way. Fighting... Why am I going to get... Experience against rogue armies. Fuck off. You know what I mean? That's that's why I'm like. Ooh, oh. 25 of Mazda Mundi, but 50 Grove local province. This is giving me like these whole. I'm gonna have to, aren't I? Yeah, I think Marco can cancel it out. Oh, I keep forgetting about Alvaro. Dark Tide looks good. Dark Tide looks super cool. Like, I am... That's going to be a game I'm going to cover. I've already done a video. I've got some speculation vid. My bike, man. My bike, man. My bike, man. Ah, all right. All right, everyone got man's ruin because apparently that's what you get when you kill Marcus. 
Uh, Necromunda. Necromunda. And it's not because they didn't give me access or anything. Uh, it's more of the case like... Damn, boy, don't release a game if it's not ready, you know? And I'm still a little salty, if I can be completely honest. I mean, we did a live stream, and one of my viewers almost had a fucking... Um, uh, what's it called? Uh, uh, a seizure, and yeah, I'm not allowing... I'm not allowing myself to play a game that's going to hurt my viewers, you know? Fuck that. Hey, my guys, hope you're doing well. Oh, yeah, hey, Bailey, how are you doing? Nice for you to join us. How are you doing? But yeah, like, I've seen some reviews of the first game, uh, of the game, the base game that launched, and it was, oh, it's amazing, this game is perfect, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, hmm. I'm holding my breath uh, for Dark Tide. Uh, not exactly blown away with the trailer. I kind of think it's going to be good. I don't know, man. Like, I see... Like, people were talking about the chevrons, right? Because the freaking... Um, the the, uh, the traitor guards have chevrons on them. And I'm like... Mm -hmm, maybe we see Iron Warriors and it won't be all fucking normal. Because, you know, obviously... Uh, camera. Thank you. Um, I love how the lizard men just instantly love me on sight. Uh, I might want to kill the Amazons, to be honest. Yeah, I will try kill them. Why not release an incomplete game, Nathan? It's not like they can just slowly patch it to full completion, right? Yeah. And still... Uh, still fucking... Um, still fucking patching it. And releasing DLC content, by the way. Woo! Yeah. No. It's a health risk. And shit like that, if you know it's a health risk, then it shouldn't be released. Same thing as Cyberpunk. Uh, what was it? They took a... Uh, what was it? They uh, they only added in the warning after review a reviewer pointed it out that it gave him a seizure or something. It's like, ha, ah, that's uh, that's a very talented developer over there. We care about our viewers. We care about our players. You know, I don't know why I'm doing that accent. Silly Nathan, you don't have to release a full game. Yeah. <laughs> It's hard to trust promotional material nowadays. But, you know, I try to be as honest as possible when it comes to DLC showings and stuff like that. If I'm having fun, I'm having fun. And I will say it if I'm having fun or not. Uh, trade agreement with Techless. I mean, for the time being, why not? You, the Netherlands are going second lockdown. She didn't look like an Amazon, exactly. That's why, um... That's, like, that's why, like... If I'm not, um... Yeah, no, it, it's just, for some reason she shows up as striker. I'm not sure why. She's actually Pemphysilia. <laughs> it's super weird, honestly. It's actually super weird. Uh, but that's why I, I, I try to be, like... That's why I won't cover, say, for example, too much of Free Kingdom. Or, or Troy, or something like that. Because if I don't know how to cover it properly, and I don't know how to highlight everything properly, there's no point me covering it and then lying to you guys, right? Because I can be very honest in saying that, yeah, sometimes I have problems. Um, I have problems in regards to trying to show off the historicals better, if you get what I mean. But... I'm, I'm learning more Free Kingdoms. I've actually been playing Free Kingdoms. And I've been playing Troy a lot more. In the possibility of making more content. And be able to show that stuff off. I think that the Total War YouTubers. Uh, Mazda Monday. No, fuck off, mate. 
I think that it's all YouTubers trying to be as honest as possible with their fan... Can you call it a fan base? Viewer base? Uh, subs? It's a weird thing calling it fans or anything, anyway. But, like, they try to be as honest as possible, and I hope I come across as an honest dude. <clears throat> Anyone see when YouTube uh, and Gmail shut down earlier today? Yeah, it was a shit show. I was panicking. One day I decide to do a Beastman video. One fucking day. So tomorrow I'm gonna have to do another one in an effort to test out my theory. It's, it's freaking Draka. I don't know why. So let's make a game. For every bug in, in a game, one CEO higher up gets in the company gets shot. I don't mean like that. <laughs> but like... Don't release a game that has obvious bugs. Why aren't they... Hmm. Hey, Alice, how you doing? <clears throat> oh, this is a shit deployment for me too. Fuck. Oh, it's because they've got a carnosaur. Okay. Wait, we'll wait a turn and see if they'll come out for us. Not possible. Did you manage to ally with Marcus? No, I killed him. He was in my way. <laughs> Sorry, talk, but like he was literally in my way, and I don't want to deal with. I, I don't want to deal with Mazda Mundi. I, I, I'm liking the Frog Prince over here. He's like we're little, uh, going a little down and shit, but like he, we're, we're we're in a good place. We're friendly. We're happy, you know. So yeah. <laughs> Uh, Troy's not worth playing. You need to get Epic for that. I mean, it's going to come out this year. Well, not this year, but next year in um, Steam. Fuck, lost the word. I like Troy, right? I like Troy. Fuck this chair. I like Troy. I think Troy is playable. I, I, I like it. I enjoy it. I think it's it's got a really awesome art style. I'm not lying to you guys. I actually genuinely like it. Yeah, the battles could be better. Uh, but I still think it's enjoyable. Doing uh, 25th birthday today, but I had to work till 11 p.m. Oh shit, dude! But hey, you got your—it's your 25th birthday at the same time that I get 25k subs. We're linked in a way. And Okoy is here. If you said Marco to him, would he respond Polo? Blech. Blech. But yeah, happy birthday, Alas. Have a good one. Oh, that joke was so bad I died. <laughs> right, um, yeah, let's go fight this. We're gonna have to fight this. I don't like this fucking map, though. It's kind of shitty. Right, what if we... Take up the pace. It is war. We're gonna have to try it. We're gonna have to try it. Yeah, okay, it's cool. O o Okoy is cool, man. Though he won't do his feed stream. Sorry, bud. But the people want what the people want. To be fair, his cyberpunk people wouldn't stop bitching about the delays. And then would uh, them complain when the game comes out. Yeah, but then... Um, CA had to be quiet in regards to the the delay for um, in the delay for the Wood Elves, right? And I think I well, I'd like I'd like to think that we would that the community itself would have responded if they would have gone, yeah, look, we need a delay. I would honestly like to think I could be deadly fucking wrong here. But I would honestly like to think that the, the community itself would have gone, that's okay, we understand. This world has been a fucking shit show this year. It's not your fault, CA. Please don't make me think otherwise. Like, I like you guys, you know? <laughs> so does she look like Draka? Oh god, what's this? Ah! <laughs> what the fuck? It's 
a chaos spawn. Oh, no. Oh, God. I don't know what's going on. They're attacking me. There's a big fucking dinosaur. There's a bunch of half-naked chicks running at me, and generally I would love this, but Christ. Alright, let's charge you guys up this way. I love how he ignores the feed stream comment. Mm. Oof. It's the demon of Zinch, yeah. I don't know what the fuck's going on. We might have to retreat though, because a rip. <laughs> Yeah, we, we might have to retreat. We might have to retreat. I was not prepared for this. Oof. Yeah, no, no, no. We're not going to fight this. Let, let's fall back. Even I'm learning at this point how to play this damn game. I mean, look at my pikemen. Woof. That pain! That pain, that absolute pain. And then, oof, that was hurting. I guess it's time to resurrect the tradition then. Are you winning, son? Nah, not so much, not now. Hey, this is the only fight I've technically lost all stream, and we're here two hours and 12 minutes. So you guys, I'm learning. Amazons are just like, get out of jungle, yeah. Uh, I, uh... Those hags came in for it hard, man. <laughs> We're going to have to retreat, though. If we can fight them without the garrison, maybe we'd be a bit better off. But those uh, those stalkers were fucking nasty. Jeez. I mean, that did level him up, though, so... Join war against the or not? No, Mazda Money, you carry on your genocide, leave me out of it. Nathan, not prepared for strong, independent women who don't need no man. Yeah, I was not prepared for that. I mean, maybe they wanted a bit of snoo snoo, but, uh. Nah. Absolute nah. Alright, so. As far as we're aware, they're not going to be moving up. We're going to try and keep away. What does the Emperor bid? On march! Praise Sigma! And we're going to have to fucking recruit again, aren't we? Jeez. That was brutal. Must rethink tactics, methinks. Got a new green screen? No, I finally sorted out that lighting. So everything looks good now. So a while back, this is the same one, right? And I couldn't get good lighting. Someone donated, I think it was um, Estefano and a few others. And I had the lighting, but it was making me too bright. It was making me like shine. And this is because I, I'm really shit with um, I'm really shit with technology in general. But okay, oh, we're missing one. All right. Yeah. But we were doing very well. Uh, like I was trying to like I was learning bit by bit. I made myself black and white and. I did this and that, so I was I was getting to the point that I was learning, but I was just it wasn't enough. And then next thing I know, one day I was fucking around with some settings because it was a day off. I was like, "All right, we'll do this, we'll do that." I think I fixed it right before the um, the twist in the twilight. Do not 
I was like, oh Christ, this is it. And it works. Uh, no, no, man, no, 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 no. Transfer guns into the main army, maybe? Uh, oh, it's not a bad idea, to be honest. But I quite like the crossbows, to be honest. Because they fire over the arc, which is working really well for me. I mean, we're going to recruit a bit more, and I think we should be fine. Yeah, we should be fine. We'll try that. Uh, where are we here? Hey, how's it going? I'm, uh, it's all going well, Necrozma1166. Uh, How are you doing, dude? Trying to ambush them outside the kitchen. <laughs> Fuck's sake. If we go full Vermintide end times, we could get some great content for Warhammer 3. We've already got some end time stuff, so I'm assuming we're going full end times. Alright, we just need to level, uh, heal up a little bit. This guy's ready. I don't want to build up the rest of the army, though, because I want to save up some cash. Yeah, we should be fine. But I think we're going okay. Have uh, the Amazons, uh... Men, or do they use sporting pools? Ah, they've got men slaves. You know, they're female after... They're, well, not f well, female, yeah, but like they're women after all. So they have to... Uh, they need to get down, get dirty. I'm on very hard, very hard. I've got some... Uh, what's this? <laughs> Everyone keeps sending me this Nathan meme now. What mods are you using? We are using the, um, uh, the Southern Realms mod, OVN Lost Factions, Recruit uh, Defeated Legendary Lords, Mixus Legendary Lords, and all the Skaven mods that I've covered because I like having them on my load order. So Clan Ferret, Clan Vulcan, and so on. Oh, and Kislev too, because I was debating either playing this or Kislev. Yeah, okay, fine. We'll recruit these guys and be done with it. Then we'll wait next turn and we'll go. Uh, let's get training and move. You have a proposal? We are willing to hear it. Mm, no. He's using the make legendary difficulty into easy difficulty. I wouldn't say that considering that uh This is the same load order that I've got in my ass kicked. When you say end times, every Warhammer fan says, oh hell no. Yeah, but imagine. Like, imagine an end time scenario for Warhammer 3. So, there's a lot of stuff. You know, there's a lot of stuff. Like, it could be done very well. By the comet. Keys left. Right, let's go up here. Let's go fight these bitches again. Let us move. Look, they're not building up an army. They are women but not female. You know what I mean. You know what I mean. I'm tired. It's been a long day. Ooh, I need to give my PC a good dusting soon. I think it's getting a little loud. Defensive Alliance? Ugh, I don't want a Defensive Alliance. I want to kill him eventually. I just don't trust Mazda Mundi. I've not seen Vikings, to be honest. I keep meaning to do it, because, like, uh, one of the bands that I really enjoy, Waduruna, uh, did the score for second season. But I've just had no time to watch it. Which is the worst? End Times... Uh, Age of Sigma or Storm Chaos. It is war. From a pot, plot point of view, so, Age of Sigma. Sigma like, us. no, no. From a law point of view, Age of Sigma. From a pure campaign sort of view, um. End times, end times. Like the, the writing was shit. Even as a campaign, it was crap. I 
replace Menace Below with uh, Doom Rockets. <laughs> That'd be kind of uh, kind of much, wouldn't it? I kind of missed this weird and random stream chat. Yeah, we've been getting really good streams lately. We've been getting really good and fun streams. I'm actually quite chuffed. Alright, so let's try and get this shit show out of the way. We know what happened last time. This time we have more pikes. I don't know what the hell keeps firing at me instantly. It's her, isn't it? Oh, now she's... Right, let me just... Uh, you gotta love when mods break because of a, a new faction, a uh, new DLC. And... I, don't, I, I don't know. I, uh, I'm just not gonna, I'm not gonna question it. We're just gonna continue and okay, let's, let's get back into the game. Alright, uh... <laughs> Nature is truly wonderful, yeah. <laughs> oh, Christ, she makes my dudes go feral. New Beastman DLC confirmed. Like she's just chilling there. Oh, I, I don't think we can do this. I don't think we can fight this. Porque estoy aquí, quién sabe? Yo qué sé. Depende. Seguro que está buscando algo de Total War Warhammer. Yeah, I speak Spanish. Can this be shown on YouTube? Hot great stag on branch rave action action. It's super weird. I mean look, the game's not even paused. She's twitching. But that's it. Yeah, I don't think we can do this. I don't know. I, I mean, the fact that she's... Uh, we could probably try. I mean, let, let's fucking try. If we lose some units, we can recruit. But I'm at that point where I'm like, I don't want to get slaughtered, but I feel like we're going to get slaughtered. It's the fucking Carnosaur. That's the one doing the most damage. Now, we do have an army of shit arriving. Why are you not corner camping yet? Because I don't like corner camping. I, I actually play for fun, man. My issue here is that, but like, uh, I, think, I, can, I think we can still win. Not enough banana. Yeah, he's uh, he's out of control too. Sabes hablar bien en español. Bueno, soy de libertad. Que espera. Time to move to Bornhub. Nah, I'm good. I'm good. Like I said, only fans. Sixty nine k. Oof, I am getting slaughtered. Bring our guys up this way. See if we can just... If we lose the first army, we're cool. Why did you job you wreck on the Storm of Chaos? It's because Storm of Chaos was done so badly, they needed to wreck... They, they needed to wreck on that shit. 
Like, let's be very honest, they needed to. Yeah, my, my army is broken. This is not going to be good. You guys are never getting to action. Yeah, they're stuck in between the trees, man. I mean, look. My first army suffered from army losses. Well, mostly. Corner camping equals winning equals fun. Ah, eh, not for me. I don't mind losing games. I, I enjoy that, you know? Book doesn't care about losing because of like a true scale of not Exactly. I, I actually don't mind losing in games because I realize that this is a war game and you can't win every war. Only fans, oh boy, where do I sign up? 69k? Why not bottleneck that bridge? Yeah, could have been a good idea. I might have to flee in all honesty. That fucking dinosaur is, uh, is doing a wonder on me, if we can be very honest. Are these women still women or are they, uh, yeah, they're still women. Barely, but they're still women. Mazda Mundi Nakey Snakey. Fuck's sake. Yeah, we're gonna have to flee. We're gonna have to flee. I know what I'm beat. I know what I'm beat. What about checkerboard? No fun? Uh, no, no, I don't mind checkerboard. It wouldn't have helped anyway. That fucking... Um, that spell he was using... Uh, not the spell, but that ability to make my stuff rampage was screwing up my lines. Marcos died, though. On march. Um, what we will have to do is just try to get the hell out of the way. To the uh, ooh, this actually might be better. Yes. Okay, so we have a... Ooh. This actually might have been better for us. So what we'll need to do is um, get Spirit Leech. See ya, Naldo. Have a good one, yeah? Do we have anything that increases our campaign movement? Life Leech. Uh, I don't want to work on that type of stuff just yet. Maybe get into the good graces with these ones, that's fine. Okay, right, she's a bit better. We're gonna move up this way. I think we're okay. Hey, Silver Wolf, how you doing? You wanna say fucking dinosaur? Yeah, yeah. You, sir, would make a terrible strategist, but an excellent general since your soldiers would be glad to die from snooze stew. I mean, you wouldn't die from snooze stew, you'd die from that fucking T Rex. Uh, right. Let's come up. Here, I'm gonna have a smoke though because it's been it's been a fair amount of time, and I do need to have a smoke. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna switch up the units. Hopefully she can though, because sometimes this doesn't let me. Yeah, okay, cool. And we need one more unit of that, so I'll give them that and we'll go from that. Yeah, cool. 
I know I did not make sense whatsoever, but this is our new army. Once we're doing that, I'm going to do this. And no, why does Master Mundi keep wanting to me to join war with him? All right, we got guns, we got crossbows, we got pikes. They ask what, what Snoo Snoo is. You never seen Futurama? Fuck! It's like the best show ever. Now I'm imagining female dinosaur Snoo Snoo. Thanks. You're welcome. Maybe merge some units. Nah, there's no need because by the time that we're able to recruit everything that we want to recruit, we'll be able to. Uh, we'll be back up to full strength. Because um, the units we want. We need to recruit from global. <coughs> Do not weakness a friend, nor are we folk. He really wants to start the war. I've seen Futurama, pal, but a fair time ago. I can't remember. Wait, do you not re-watch it? Right. Who doesn't re-watch Futurama? It's like the best show ever. What would you have of me? And you have to cry when um, when what's his face happens, you know? Like this, the uh, the puppy episode. Uh, Pike Man. I am going insane. Where the fuck are my Pike Man? Pikeman. Cool. Well, you were you were correct with both accounts when you said black monkey or black money. Is it war? Because the uh, the money was that she wants a peace treaty. What? You keep attacking them in the domain, you should fight them outside their kitchen. Now I'm coming in with, with gunfire now, so I'm taking out that fucking dragon. Dragon? T-Rex. Summon upgrade. Yes, please. Someone's leveled up. Give them full armor. This time we've got a lot more gunpower. I'm ready. I'm ready. Oh, let me just reply to someone. So, I've got a special uh, collab happening on the... On the 19th, very likely. On the same day that Rappin releases. And that's going to be cool. That's going to be really cool. I can't wait to, to go, for you guys to find out who the, uh, the guest is. Like, I am genuinely a big fan of his. And um, it's going to be really, really cool to actually do a stream with him. Should everything go correct, then we're going to have, um, it's going to be a fucking awesome stream, guys. Like, uh, I really can't hype it up enough. Oh my god, Snoo Snoo with the giant women. Exactly, see? But it's a really cool game. Oh, fuck off. No, 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 no. Are you going for the Amazons? Because I'm going to have to kill you too. Camera went off, by the way. Yeah, camera goes off when I smoke. I don't like smoking on camera.
Yeah, we're gonna have to fight him. No, I do not smoke joints. It was a cigarette, but I don't like being a bad influence. Remember that at, um, as a person who uh, covers... Ooh, wait. Did something just happen? So that my chat died. That's fine. As a person who covers uh, Total War Warhammer, I have uh, younger viewers. And I don't want to be a bad impression on them. Oh shit, this is going to suck. Okay. Fuck. <laughs> so one bastard to the next. Alright, let's get a little closer and... Let's just fucking wait. Is it Justin Bieber? No, it's not Justin Bieber. But it's someone really, really cool. Like, uh, we've spoken about this in the past, and it's going to be awesome. Is it James Hetfield? But assuring you that he's a different James Hetfield? No, no, it's not James Hetfield. It's someone related to Total War. And he's super cool. And I think it's going to be really fucking fun. Not only do you guys get the release of Ratfin as a little Christmas gift, and obviously if you will get the Minecraft server soon because we hit 25k and a promise is a promise. But um, it's going to be cool. It's going to be really, really cool. Joke since you're in Gibraltar. What do you mean? Congrats, your Amazons have evolved into lizard people. Yeah, and they're going to cause me problems. But we're going to have to fight them, so screw them. Uh, screw it. I, I, I really... Oh, my back, man. Piece of shit game. <laughs> Right, let's just recruit another one. That was just me going on a resolve because I was like, oh yeah, you know, this should be fine. Uh, hi, Nathan, as a descendant of Conquistadores, uh, I approve of this stream. Awesome. I'm glad you do, my dude. Casualty replenishment, let's just try to get this back up and running. Um, should younger. Uh, should, yo should younger viewers be playing Total War? Uh, well, I've been playing since I was, what? When did Rome come out? Rome 1? I've been playing since Rome 1. And I'm 28 now, so I'm an old bastard. Uh, I don't see a problem. It's uh, The historical games can teach you history. can teach you warfare. can teach you strategy and stuff like that. It also does teach you a fair bit of like real history, despite the fact that it's a, f a sandbox game. Uh... Is it the guy that voiced Fraught or Magical? Well, you guys will find out soon. I do have something planned with uh, with Magical soon, though. Because uh, it's been a while. It's been a while since uh, MK and I have done anything together. And to be honest, I, I do miss playing with him. And no, it's not Legend. It would be cool to do something with Legend, but he doesn't like playing co-op or head-to-head. -head, so there's no really a point to ask him. Fuck's sake, uh, why is this one embedded? Here we go. You have a proposal? We are willing to hear it. Meta Alliance, no. Two thousand four, so I was Maths. I was maths. If you take away 16 years from me now, I was 12. Yeah, 12. Close to Moroccan. Yeah, yeah. What do you mean, close to Moroccan? This will bolster the nation. You are um, British, right? I am gifted. Out of the question. Right, we're gonna have to fight these guys, go for these areas. We're gonna have to take this area. Like, all this 
needs to be ours. For some reason, these dwarves are still there. I'm assuming that... Oh, okay. I was about to say I'm assuming that there was Skaven there, but, like, uh... The guy is still alive for some reason? Am I the secret guest? You could be. So how are you guys finding the stream? Because we might continue this. Uh... We could continue this on Wednesday. Because I'm I'm rather enjoying this, in all honesty. Now let's see if we can... Let's see if we can... Uh... Yeah, let's see. You, you and Legend could do a Vermintide 2 stream. Him and Lawmaster Sotek had a fun impromptu stream a week or, or so ago where they played with Mrs. Legend. Well, I didn't know they did. You have a proposal? I'll be honest, like, uh, I kind of switch off YouTube when I'm not working because like, I'll, I'll watch Legend stream and stuff. But like, uh, in most cases, I kind of just switch off YouTube and just go on my own little world. Because... I don't like watching too much Warhammer content when I'm creating Warhammer to content. It gets a little bit uh, much, if you get what I mean. What's your law name, mate? Uh, well, I'm the Great Book. Yes, my lord. War calls. Raise your weapons. Mm, Fight for the nation. It would be cool to do something with Legend at some point, though. Well, we've already done a little bit of a collab anyway. But he's a nice dude. It would be nice to do something. I cannot comply. Love your content, by the way. Thank you, Tiago. Right, um, let's just... There. Oh, this is going to kind of suck, isn't it? They are no more. Now. Should we just fight? Let me just see what the map looks like. It's not great. How did you get? Uh, oh yeah, I've got recruit legendary lords, uh, defeat le uh, defeated legendary lords. So I've got him, uh, her, and uh, Sunscryer. I've got Lupio. Um, we're gonna have to go in. We're gonna have to go in. My issue is that. I mean, they've only got two big boys, don't they? Yeah, two Bastilladons. They should be doable. Fuck it, let's go. I'm not going to auto resolve this. Let's go. Need a break sometimes. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Like, um, I watch my, my friends, of course. So, like, I'll, I'll watch Legend streams because I really enjoy Legend streams. Like, I, I feel like I'm learning a bit from him. Uh, of course, I watch Major Kill. I, I find his content really humorous, and it's very law fact friendly. Uh, we've also got what well, Baldy. I, I love his stuff. When, when I sit down to paint, I like putting on Baldy's videos. Um, oh, oh, awesome! I thought these guys were gonna spawn somewhere else. That's fucking great. Right, so I think we're okay in terms of deployment. Like, we've got all the bases covered, so I think we're fine. And let's go from there. Warhammer Fantasy Spanish Conquistadors, let's go. Yeah, no, it's a pretty cool faction, isn't it? Uh... <laughs> Legend's not nice, he calls you fucker in every video. I think he's quite nice. Like, I, I, I can get along with him. He's, he's a nice dude. Shit, 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 shit. Fuck, 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 fuck. Alright, no, 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 no. Mistakes were made, mistakes were made. Um. Do you tell you have any unique units? Yeah, the Southern Realms mod gives a bunch of unique units to all the factions. Ay. Mistakes were made. Okay, one... Two, 
Fuck's sake, someone had to go on Steam right now when I'm just trying to increase the speed of the game. I noticed it's you trolling poor Linksy on the streams. Yeah, no, nah, Linksy's cool, man. Like we've got something we've got something planned out. Voldemort's voice is very soothing whilst painting. Yeah, now the dude's awesome. We had planned to do a stream, but he's kind of busy at the moment because he's trying to batch uh, record videos. So he can actually take some Christmas time off, which, yeah, he needs. Oh, this is bad. Yeah, I made a mistake. Noob's Guide must be my favorite Warhammer videos ever. Oh, you're talking about... Um, you're talking about Cody Bonds and stuff. Yeah, man, like, uh, Cody's got some really cool stuff there. I really liked his front one, too. I get along super well with Cody. He's really, really nice. Uh, I made a mistake. Too much. I got cocky. I got cocky. I got cocky. Uh, it's okay. We got pikemen and spearmen on the way. Let's just hope for the best. I mean, this army is dead and buried, but we can start recruiting. What's your opinion on who and on and who's your favorite Uber's Reich Five? Uh, I don't play a lot of I don't play a lot of um, what's it called? Vermin Tide. Jeez, my my mind, my mind. Uh, but I was a big fan of the uh, the dwarf. I quite like the dwarf and his playstyle. Rip, this is going to become a bit of an issue. I mean, we're doing damage, which is fine. It could have been better. But then again, rip. Is the stream with Warmaster and Warlock? I think he's actually here. Are you still here, Warmaster? We were doing... Um, I, I want to do some more collabs. The, the problem is just finding the time. Will Ratfin's law include T-posing on the da Damas Kron? Yeah, it's uh, it's going to have some cool shit. We're establishing a bunch of law. We're going to have a, a bunch of really cool shit up. Uh, let's bring you this way. Yeah, this army's uh, dead and buried. I think that oh this is bad is a quote that describes this campaigning in the best in the best way. Hey, no, we've actually done quite good in this campaign. We've actually done really really well. It's only now that it's gone a bit south. But I think it's because it's because I'm tired. Because that generally happens when I get sleepy. I'll start making silly mistakes. And the problem is that I still need to record a video. Now, if we lose one army, it's fine, as long as we don't lose them both. That was a monster hunter full? What do you think about... Uh, I can't pronounce that name. Uh, critique of modern Total War? Everyone's entitled to their own opinion. I like the modern Total Wars. Like, if I didn't, I wouldn't be playing Warhammer, because that's a modern Total War. And to be honest, I really enjoy it. I, I love Total War Warhammer. If I didn't, I wouldn't be dedicating the large majority of my content in regards to that. I think it's a really, really good game, and it's everything I ever wanted, to be honest, because... Uh, shit, 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 my pipe went... Ooh, I'm going to get slaughtered. I think it's a great game. I think, like, CA did an amazing job bringing my favorite world to life. That's all I can really say. Alright, you guys need to go in there. Yeah, I've, I've lost this fight. Yeah. Mistakes were made. Yes, 
no way in hell I can defeat this. Yeah, let's, con let's concede. <laughs> oh. I could have done this better. <coughs> I could have done this better. Ah, it's fine. As long as we're... Ooh, whew, big damage. Onwards. Sigma. We'll bring back Marco. This will bolster the nation. Sigma. Oh, no. Yeah, Marco's gonna die. Eh, hey, we'll try to survive this. If someone made the McDonald's faction mod, would you play it? Maybe for April Fools. Uh, it's those chameleon skinks that are going to be a problem. We don't have any guns either. I mean, still worth a shot. We might as well. Uh, where are we here? I mean, you can play a general uh, in a dark fantasy world. I'm more than happy with this game. Yeah, same. I grew up with Warhammer Fantasy, so for me, it's like, damn. Okay, we're gonna have to try and be a bit smarter about this. Maybe just this once. We'll call a camp. No, because there's freaking trees everywhere. I think they'll probably try to go with a to uh, Lord of the Rings total. Well, actually, we can corner camp here. That's fine because that that that's got that there. I think they'll probably go with. Um, ooh, okay, so that's that's kind of fucked too, isn't it? There, there, and bring these guys here, and then we can just re-establish ourselves up to around this. I'll probably think they'll do all of the rings to war. In all honesty, it just sounds like something that they'd do. Do you think that uh, do you think that cafe is technically confirmed? I think so. Honestly, I really, really do. I I want to hope so. You know. Right, we're not gonna win this, but we might as well try to do as much damage as possible. Because we know we've got two fucking bastilatons to deal with. I mean, we're almost at the end of the stream anyway. Trees do not matter if you stand with them. Yeah, but I can't see for shit. That's the problem. Like, even like this... Hassle. Like, I'm half blind as it is. I should be wearing glasses. Right, we're not going to be able to do anything over here. So what we're going to just try to do is bring these guys over here. Fucking crap. All right. No, 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 no. No, but still don't know. The Witcher books are still damn good, though. Like, like really, really good. Uh, you. There, 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 there. And we can just run through this. I mean, we're not going to win, but we might as well just try. The fucking horned ones. It'll take a while before they can attack us. We will have another army up and running. Now, the main idea is just keeping these guys busy. 
which I should be able to do if I just keep doing this. So much damage. I thought he was in a big boy. Well, we're supposed to get more, um... We're supposed to get another fucking Game of Thrones book, aren't we? But the dude's working on a novella or something? I I'm not too sure. I don't keep up with, uh... Uh, Martin. Nippon's doable. Nippon's doable. Remember that these were all established factions for like second edition. Uh, yeah, we're gonna get our asses handed to us. Yeah, we're yeah, gonna we'll start dying. Uh, it's fine. Okay. Close defeat, you know, we did our damage, we did as much as we could. Lost 47, which is basically fuck all. <laughs> ah. It's laziness, I think, that he doesn't want to finish them. You know what books I've been getting into though? Uh, the the Malazan Chronicles. I thought they were really, really good. They would fit really well for a Total War, but I don't think uh, they would get too... Did they leave it? Oh, okay. Why did they let Marco survive? He could have easily attacked Marco. Okay, well, his loss is my game. Uh, let's go up here. Heavenly Goddess, hey Nathan, just wanted to uh, say hi and give my support. However, brief and final exam prep going to be writing a three hour take home exam. Woof. Yeah, no worries. Don't worry. I'm, I'm not going to be long for long because we're almost, uh, we're almost done with our usual uh, time. But damn, good luck. Wheel of Time Total War Magic would have to be removed. Mm, why so? What do you think that? Look, the the, the Witcher total uh, the the Witcher is basically just everything you can expect from a Netflix series, though. It's just fan service, isn't it? Like, we need to get back here and defend this. I mean, I, I remember watching. Uh, <laughs> I remember watching the TV show with someone, and we we're both looking at each other like, "Didn't this happen much later?" It's like, "Yep." Trade agreement dissolved with Nagriff. Uh, I didn't even realize I had one with Nagriff. Okay, we're gonna get up here, and then we're probably gonna have to end it. But what we're gonna do is gonna find someone to host. But I think we're going to continue this campaign on Wednesday. Still waiting for your green skin cheerleaders? Same. Absolutely same. Fuck you, Venris. <laughs> uh, he's a good lad. I do like him. <coughs> Ew, we might lose that. That's perfectly fine. We can move back, if anything. But what we're going to do here is... Find someone to host, because we've been going on for three hours, actually, on the dot, as far as we are here. But I do need to call it a day, because I am tired as hell after the gym. And uh, I think it would be kind of cool if we managed to get a little bit of sleep, you know? 
So let's find here, total warhammer. Let's find someone that we can chuck a host. I think we did War Master recently, didn't we? Uh... Yeah, let's, let's host Linksy. I haven't done that in a while. And then next time we'll host uh, Warmaster. But I haven't uh, hosted Linksy in ages. So uh, it's important to spread it out a bit. So when this pops up, guys, you will know that I'm going to have a uh, drop here so you can host, uh, join the host. I'll link it in the chat and so on. But with that, my friends, as always, thank you so much for everything. This has been an amazing stream. I can't believe we've hit 25K. That's absolutely fucking insane. Thank you so much as always. And I shall see you all again very, very soon. Have a good day.